let's see. Let's get the the all red team going here. Because the all red team is sexy. Shirksha. Yeah. I like that. I like the Executioner Sword. How goes the Dagger Sunder? We just started. Hey, little Snipes, how's it going? Welcome on in. I Snipes. I, is that I? It's I Snipes. Sorry, I said little the first time. I'm so sorry. My dyslexia is really rough. You Those clicks in the stream starts here are incredible. Yeah, yeah, they're super fun. I'm really glad that I took the time to. I have. I just have like all of them. Every time I edit them, I throw them into a folder and I have a, a thing that just randomizes it every time. So it's super, super fun. Just, uh, just a nice way to just keep people entertained while I'm off doing stuff, because I've got hundreds of those clips, so. You can find more shorts on the YouTube. You can, you can find pretty much all the those shorts on the YouTube. Yeah. You. With open arms. Oh, Berryman got trapped. Ha 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 You're stinky. Hi, Berryman. Poor stinky boy. Uh, how's it going, man? A brilliant conclusion. A brilliant conclusion. Uh, do I have Reap on? I don't, but I do have a Zealous Accusation. I'm probably doing enough damage here to get the, uh, get Zealous going here. Malaise no, I can't. Oh, God. Stinky leaves. Boom. Boom. Good job, Gonzalez. You got somebody real quick and in a hurry there. A fortune in memories. Long I've heard forgotten. that this team is really fun to play. This, if you don't know what the usual suspects is, this is like the team that you start with in Darkest Dungeon One, which is why people are really hyped that uh, Reynold is back. Uh, the other one is Red Hook, which you just flip the. This is these are the four starting heroes. Regardless of what order you put them in, they're the four starting heroes that you normally have. So, you know, we might not keep them in this, the familiar you know, Crackles organization, but you know, again. okay. So this is something that somebody made a point to me about and it was that um as much as sometimes the bounty hunter might not be the best Experience. choice for your team he's the fun Who's choice for your team and you should just take him if you get him so we're gonna take the bounty hunter um i'm probably gonna switch him for dismiss just because i think that'll be fun and i don't take him very often so i think it'll be fun to take the bounty hunter and uh and just just enjoy some bounty hunter shenanigans so on that note Let's go ahead. I'm going to upgrade Inspire and Cry just to have us get a stress heal like right off the bat. And well, we're doing Act 5, price. by the way, because this is... Uh, I'm going to get a couple achievements by beating this. Um, so that's going to be good for us. I also haven't done... I'm, I mean, I'm guessing I know that the Warlord would be the Crusader's Act 5 thing, but it'll be interesting to see the Crusader with Act 5. Uh, we've got a nice bit of luxury gear here for relationships, so let's go for Orphan Wolf Cub. This is going to be a, like basically a positive in like 12% for our relationships, which is a really good find for us. And then we'll get some food. Uh, we're going to go ahead and replace Dismas now. To damnation. Hire him in. We got Duong with the utility belt. Okay, so flashbang skills will blind on base. Hurlbat skills will weaken on base. We're not going to be using Hurlbat. But we can use Flashbang, and also Caltrops, which we can use, uh, gives us an additional debuff piercing, which is okay, I guess. Um, so we're probably just going to use pretty much his base kit here. Come Hither is going to be really good for us. Um, yeah, I think this is fine. This is a fine base kit for us. The next stop is leagues away. Plan accordingly. <laughs> All right, so we got ourselves a, a bounty. Look how bounty hunter just stares right at the camera. He's just looking right at you like, Mikata, how's it going? Welcome on in. Good to have you here. Uh, what are our routes here? We might Rain, be able to do an early lair with rock. this team. Like, Is there no sanctuary from this madness? Do I really need the mark? You're probably right that I don't. Um... If I was running Wanderer, I would probably run it because Wanderer gets that combo, but uh, that combo benefit. But we're not running Wanderer, so like maybe not. Uh, execution two move is very good. When target is dazed or stunned, we're not going to be dazing or stunning. 
Um, so let me go ahead and complete all these, by the way. I mean, yeah, the the finish him is really good. Stare down is also a pretty good one. Um, bodyguard. Sure, we'll go finish him. That's fine. Um, I'm wondering if we can take on Leviathan here, but I think it might be a bit scary for us. I mean, this team can do it. This team can definitely do it. It's just going to be a bit scary. I just don't know if that's a great choice for us. Um, but we can get a good bleed trinket from here if we go this way, which could be very good for a highwayman. We can get burn trinkets in the sprawl, which could be very good for the... We could get trinkets that might allow us to burn things without having burn abilities. Um, which could be really good. Or just burn trinkets in general that are helpful for... Let's go, let's go for the sprawl. More safe routes. Avoid the watchtower. We're probably not going to go for the librarian, city. but we can still have fun with it. Another inferno um, of mutilation and madness. Is this the first in? This is the first in, yes. Um, so let's go ahead. We'll get we've already bought food for everybody, so I'm gonna buy some items here. Glimmer. I've just found that glimmer is, is quickly become something that I really enjoy having on my team. Just in case we need it. It's also a flammable item now, so it does have like some some other synergies there. I'm gonna just take the two laudanum. Uh put that there, we'll put that there. We'll go ahead, we'll give him that. Everybody else gets bread. 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 Stew pot any good? Stew pot is very good. We just haven't bought it. I um I went for the luxury gear item for the uh for the orphan wolf cub. I, I think we're good here, so let's roll into it. But stew pot probably would have been my second my second buy there. It's a it's a very good uh very good thing to get. I like how we started this with the usual suspects and have immediately Behold, removed Dismas from the team. The great but that's fine. He's chilling. He needs some time to kind of contemplate his take aim nerf, flame. you know. Really, really think about what the devs did to him there. Don't really need the assistance encounter this early. Um, I mean, it could give us an item. We'll, we'll go for it. That's fine. It's a... I mean, taking four stress right off the bat really isn't... I mean, Bounty Hunter is a professional. I mean, he is. Whispers. He is an absolute professional, a consummate professional at that. I'm going to try my best to take him more often. I've been really bad about taking him, and I, I think that's just unfair to him. Early scouting is really good. Here, let's go for it. Yeah, I used to take him more, and then I kind of stopped taking him, and like I think, like I, like I was saying, I think that's just unfair. Like, he's a really good character, and I just... I, I so often I will not take him just so that way I can maybe take him at a more strategic time and it never lines up right never like goes the way I want it to so we're gonna go for the fight here um, the hospital maybe isn't the best choice for us but we can we can make it work I shouldn't check what his quirks are if you hope to heal hemophobic is whatever yeah I just I just want to take him more I mean he's there Enriching themselves I mean, the point the is, he, he is OP, right? Like, that's the whole point of him being kind of rare and whatnot. But, like, because I, because I, um, it's because I, I'm always trying to line him up for, like, the perfect time to use him that I never end up using him because it never lines up that way, right? Um, so, just is what it is. I think, I think I'll get more value out of it if I just use him, use him more. Did not blind, which is interesting. That's gonna move him. <laughs> Using his stun to get the damage for finish him. Who's stun? For who knows what lurks in the beyond. The bounty hunter stun? When you have to line up the stun correctly, right? Like it, it'd be hard to do the stun and then do finish him uh without the somebody else getting a turn in between of a speed of two right like he'd have to stun and then that character would have to not have their 
turn before he goes again um, for the stun to stay in place. Like, we still have it equipped, but nobody here is dazed or anything, so I don't think it's really going to do do too much for us there. We need It works well if somebody else can daze or apply the daze, but um, we don't have that, so it's, it's not the best, we can really. We rely only upon each other. Yeah, he's really good with Jester because of his ability to apply those combos. Um, yeah, if we weren't running usual suspects, I probably would have run Jester for that for that very reason. So, his crit tokens are. Pretty nice. Well done. Jest Jester's good with anybody. That's I mean anybody who can apply as much combo as Jester can makes him a pretty pretty potent ally to have on your team for sure. The enemy weakens and wanes. The slow suffering begins. How many turns do we have left on this? I don't know. Um, it's a five turn cooldown. We still have four rounds left, so we should be pretty good on it. That's probably a good time to pop mantra. Fucking dog, man, I know. Those dogs are ridiculous sometimes. There we go. A lesson taught. Those are sturdy enemies. That was a rough start for a sturdy. Like sturdy, these guys are not pumping out enough damage quite yet, so. For us to get started that early, that's why they they're feeling a little, little lackluster. <laughs> it's also why they weren't moving around very much. So she weeps for the fallen. Four dogs and a double dodge, and they constantly generate dodge. Yeah, enough. those those fights in the, in the creature den can definitely be a rough one for you. Um. um <laughs> I'm gonna try to be strategic and use some ablative powders to help us with stress mitigation here just a little bit. I'm sure there's some like we can take full advantage of it. Found Shelby's ring, Pog. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Uh let's go to the lair. Hey, that ring fund's doing well, and hey, you know what? I believe there's a discount on subs right now because of uh, it being the last couple weeks of December. There's like a sub discount going on. So if y'all want to, you know, I see all the money from that. And Twitch just, you guys just get it cheaper. So like, you know. No doubt the source is. Right, I'm not fighting the librarian right now, but we can at least get some money and stuff out of this. The library burns, and with it, the remains of philosophy, reason. And insight. Incremental, but deadly all the same. Bleeding tornado. Good resists, everybody. Really glad that the burn resists came in clutch there for us. Why the hell people burn this biome down? I don't know, because they crazy. Don't need to make no sense. They just crazy like that. 12 to 8 damage. Yeah, sure. 12 to 18 damage. Sorry. Early results are encouraging. Yeah, we did get a, a resist there. That should be a resist. Yep. Makes sense. Yep, sure does. 
A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Good resist, thank you. Oh yeah, Bounty Hunter just doing the Lord's work right now. You love to see it. Come on, Crusader. There you go. Ounce of Prevention doing some work for us right now, that's for sure. Definitely got a lot less dots happening than we would normally at this point. Found a little stress back here. Target, remove dodge and stealth. I need to remember that that's a really good option for us to uh, to do that. You just say, leave it to me, yeah. You probably just say, fuck off, give me my money. No, you're supposed to dodge it. Well, at least you resisted the burn. And the stress, too. When does stress resist come from? It's not from... Ounce of Prevention. Uh, it's probably from the, uh, the Wolf Cub, right? You can heal yourself, so you might as well. Or leave me alone, yeah. Damn it. Yeah. That was no way that was going through. Get a nice little heal here. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly who he is, probably. You're probably right. I don't see why it wouldn't be right. All right, I'm gonna advance here. Yeah, we're not taking on the, the librarian. We don't have the. We don't have the kit for the librarian right now. I really don't think we do. Maybe if we had a push ability, I might feel a bit more open to that idea, but we don't, so I'm not going to mess with it. Let's get the concentration going. Uh, what does his utility belt do with caltrips again? Just increases debuff resist piercing. So it gives them like the movement speed resist, like and all that. Yeah, not really enough for me. Just go for kills where we can get them. On to the next. an annoying set of things that just happened. Go ahead and crit that. Get that moved over here. Might as well remove the corpses. Uh, Consecration of Fortitude. Yeah, if that had been aggressor, he would have been able to get the, the kill there. Good value out of blinding gas right there. Ounce of prevention would probably be a good call. Would have been a good call. It's a little late now, I think. We probably could have ignored quite a bit of the damage here. Do see free? Oh yeah, yeah. Um, they are all free right now. Yeah, somebody, I think Bate put that in the Discord. I'm not a, uh, I'm not a Destiny person, but hey, you know what? If that's your thing, that's your thing. Go get it. God, Infernal Taskmaster is such a dumbass ability. Like, for the amount of stress and damage it can do, should not be as readily available. Should have, like, a three cooldown or something. 
but alas, it does not. Um, and I can mantra here and heal these two up. Get her healed up. A lot of rounds spent healing there, but this team does have a lot of healing. I might take off battle heal, honestly. It's a good ability, but like we've got plenty of healing right now. Because I'm a console player? Well, that, you can't use the DLC because console? That's interesting. Hi, Asa. How's it going? What's mine? Get over here. I guess not. Okay, you can stay over there. That's fine. I claimed it because, you know, free. I mean, that's totally valid. You never know when you might want to play it, right? So... Man, I would love something like Char Charred Litany and Sacred Scribbles on Zealous Accusation. Like, that's a good find. But I just, I don't think I have any way of dealing with the Librarian right now with this team. I mean, once he gets into rank three, kinda, it would be a race of damage at the end there. I don't have a way to deal with the dodge. I mean, I kind of, I mean, I guess I have Illuminate, which kind of deals with the dodge. Hmm. No, we don't do it. We don't do it. Even with Bounty Gun on our team, we don't do it. If he was in rank four and I had like Hurl Bat and stuff, then maybe. In fact, not even maybe. I definitely would, but I don't have him equipped for that, that loadout, which is one of the reasons I wish you could switch up your abilities during the course of a lair. I feel like that just makes sense. It's like, you know, you're, you've beaten a fight, you know, you get to the the door, right? In most every other game, you'd have like that second where you could like, okay, let me check my abilities and whatnot. Let me restock before we go into the boss room. I get it. Like, I, I know why they don't want people doing that. It would be very powerful, but I don't know. The loathing howls. Oh well. Dagger DLC. I've I've never played Mobile Destiny. I flame. I just don't think it's my this type of game, but I know a lot of people see. really love it. Alright, do I wanna keep battle heal or do I wanna swap? Or do I wanna swap like rallying cry for reap or something? I'm finding that I might want to use reap or even tenacity. Um tenacity could be a big because we've got an, enough healers on the team as it is. Tenacity would be a good kind of start for us start with tenacity and just be able to get the heals every time we use an attack has to be melee skills though and with magnesium rain we can get some good value out of this i think yeah i think we're gonna use this more than rallying cry so let's just go for this hey fatboy slim how's it going welcome on in wouldn't be a butlinge yeah butlinge it's true Change the ability since it resets the tokens, bring people back to the original. But yeah, it would be OP. It would be. I'm, maybe, like, if you could only do it to one character or something. I don't know. So here we go. Here's a bounty hunter moment. Won't affect our relationships. We can go for it. Ah, I love it when this happens. So not even hastened. We just have a slow team. Ah, the bleed and burn combo into horror no stun okay good uh good start for us here let's go ahead and just heal that off and then i'm gonna start with tenacity here get that buff the darkness that bounty hunter suffer um we can go ahead and put that on him just to help with the stress and then we can mag rain here and pull her like fuck you all I'll grab money and leave him next to him let's fight yeah can't play it's honestly the only mmo that i can even play because i hate 9, nine i mean that's a that's a good uh advocation for it 14 heal from that i mean I, we didn't need that heal but i just wanted to see what i could do with it fuck, 27 crit god damn hell yeah go ahead and peel the dodge off of him we're gonna hit into the repost, we might as well actually hit. 
Or you get blinded. That works too. And he just gets his dodge back anyway, so. It's great. Ooh, it's the bounty hunter. It is the bounty God, stop giving him dodge. Shit. It's annoying. Stop it. Such an annoying enemy. I should be better about focus firing him down. Uh, let's go ahead and do fortitude here. This, oh my god. Such an annoying combination. I'll focus fire you down. Ooh. Don't tempt me of a good time. Right, let's get rid of this fucking fire lady. Just so I don't end up with this fucking attack over and over and over again. The slow suffering begins. It's not physician. No, nope. surgeon. Ow. Gross, too. Just because Alchemist is broken doesn't mean that the others are bad. It just means that Alchemist is broken. You having fun over there, Shlooby? Gross! Okay, he's dead. The aggressor path is funny because he just ends up with like zero. Oh god! Well, we may have to switch to uh, Alchemist. <laughs> I can't. I mean, I can't realistically not take early experiment and use it, right? Festers. It just removes all of our bleed dealt. So, like, we have to switch to... If we're going to use it, we'd have to switch to, uh... Alchemist. Which, like, I don't want to, kind of, because it's, like, it's a little OP. But also, like, who gives a fuck? If we got the, we got the trinket for it, right? Like, that's, uh... It's a good sign. It'll definitely help with our backline damage, because we're running yellow hand on the Highwaymen right now. Which, we're going to struggle with that backline damage. We'll see how we feel when we get to the end. I don't know how much, you know, it's going to cost most of our relics at this rate. We advance relentless. They'll perish. Okay. I blessed the alchemist of items. Yeah, you showed up and blessed, blessed the alchemist. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. Um, oof, that's rough, Gonzalez. Okay, I mean, the bounty hunter still works in that position, so it's fine. The double whip crack into Alchemist or to the Plague Dogs is a little weird. F fucking fish took my octopus. Fucking fish. Let us hope to finish this quickly. That's annoying because that's going to dodge. Now my fucking, I guarantee you, this guy is going to dodge it and we won't get the heal. Yep, because that's how that fucking works. Thankfully, we do have a move that ignores block, which is good. There we go. Holy fucking shit. Crit 16? Jesus. I don't remember her spamming fire rises like this before, but this is really starting to piss me off. Yeah, it seems the game does hate Surgeon. Okay, that was a good hit. Oh, I maybe should have kept her there for the heal. God, she dodged that shit. Oh my god. We are going to lose our Plague Doctor. Are you fucking shitting me? Uh... She's gonna die. One yeah. less obstacle in our path. 
I have to abandon because this is supposed to be an unusual suspects run. Wow. Do not despair. There is nobility in the attempt. That fucking sucks. Jesus Christ. All right. <laughs> Up ahead. DBR is a fucking myth. Expanse. God damn it. Once more into the maelstrom. In search of what hope yet remains. Ugh. That's annoying. I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm struggling with Crusader. His damage output is not good, in my opinion. I feel like he's so reliant on others. I know he's more of a support character, but like, I would like to play him as like a primary damage dealer. But I just feel like I'm so reliant on getting like strength tokens or something going on him to even be able to try to do that. The crossroads. We're lost. Might have to run him as a wanderer. I mean, their way. I don't know. Hunted, harried, a fugitive seeking to outpace the past. <sighs> Head in the sand. Not good. Oh, we get to keep our highwayman because he didn't actually die. That's funny. Oh man. This is this is where I hate the RNG sometimes. Where I, j I just I mean Sanguine is great. Don't get me wrong, but Soft is really annoying. We have Soft and Head in the Sand, so we're gonna be dealing with a lot of blind on this team. I just wish there was a better way for me to apply combo so I could take advantage of the tokens for a Wanderer. Um, for a Wanderer on uh, the Crusader, but there isn't any way to do that. Like, besides point blank shot or tracking shot, which I'm not doing those, there's just not really any good way of applying combo. I mean, blinding gas can apply combo, but. Oh, there it is. I'm surprised nobody said that before now. GG, Bate. Keep Reynold, please. As in, you want Reynold, or do you want somebody else to be Reynold? Hmm. I don't know, man. I'm struggling with this team comp. I'm struggling with Reynold on this. I don't know what to play him as. Like, Frontline Banneret obviously doesn't work. I, Templar is a little weird, too, because... I mean, it still does the damage, I guess. It's just the combo. Like, nobody's nobody's applying combo on this team. And everybody's consuming it besides her, besides Junior. Um, so, like, where where are we getting the... Uh... I just don't know where we're getting the... You want... Oh, that's you. You're picking his name to be Reynold. To lock him in as Reynold? Okay. Very well. Um. Yeah, I mean, I just think... Like, we're gonna sometimes get combo just from weird circumstances, but... Like, I, I mean, I guess Zealous Accusation is where the combo can come from. We can open with Zealous and hope that we lean into a combo. Um, maybe we play around with Divine Comfort. We're going to run Templar, right? He does have his upgrade to, what is it, Radiance? No, which one is it? Oh, is it Banneret that transfers the... No, I thought it was Templar. One of these transfers... Regen, right? There we go. Rally and Cry. Ten transfers the Regen. Gives Guard. Gives plus 30% healing received. And transfers Regen. 
no, it's uh, it's rallying cry. Tenacity just gives him block. Um, yeah, I, I thought it was tenacity too, honestly. Plus fifty percent healing received, which is good. These are these are good. Okay, so we're probably gonna go smite and zealous because we we need some form of combo generation. I'm not crusader anymore. Sorry, Gonzalez, you got you got dead. That's uh, that's just the way the game goes. Unfortunately. So we want Rallying Cry. I mean, we're going to need Inspiring Cry for the Stress Heal. He's the only one who can do it, right? And I would love to use Reap too, but that's just not what we've got. It's just not in the books for us. The thing is, he transfer regen to target when target HP is below. Well, we lost uh, we lost the Plague Doctor, and we're, we can't keep on because we've got this is supposed to be an unusual suspects run. She died real quick in an hurry. So. Uh, there's too many buttons I want to use on him, man. Probably Radiance then. Be him for one region. Um, I might not grab him though. Are you sure you don't want to name somebody else while you're here? Hmm. Highwayman taken. I can rename the Highwayman. We've we've had him for a while, and I don't really care for what he has, honestly. So I'm fine. We'll go ahead. We'll just restart. We'll get a whole. We'll get a, a fresh, a fresh Highwayman. See what we get here. Why can I not reset him? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Coward. Great. That's fine. And Crusader. Crusader's already taken. <laughs> Sorry, Gonzalez. Somebody renamed him Reynold. So I'm gonna I'm gonna give you uh There you go. Yeah, yeah, highwayman. There you go. Yeah, somebody somebody named him Reynold. <laughs> uh, he's he's locked in as Reynold. Cause somebody wants to be funny. Um, alright. So I guess we're still gonna stick with yellow hand, I think. Uh, I'm a coward. It's okay. Probably not duelist advance then, since, uh, since he is the coward, we probably don't wanna go that route. Um, we can go with something like this. We can use tracking shot just to um, we're just gonna go with Alchemist. I, I didn't want to, but I think we're we're at the point where we need to. Um, I still think. Well, we don't really need the Mag Rain anymore, do we? So we can go for. We can use Emboldening Vapors. I mean, it's not great. I wish it did more on non-physician paths, but it is what it is. Um, Disorienting Blast is probably the move to go for then. And then Junior, we're gonna go Seraph. He's got a path. Um. All right, <laughs> I'm struggling with a crusader, man. I really am. I, I'm finding him not the not my favorite hero to play, but I think I just need to give him more of an opportunity. Sometimes he works okay, but I feel like I'm like smite hits for like so little. It it feels like it does. It maybe doesn't hit for that little. Like five to seven is more than four to six for crush. Um, so he's doing more damage than like crush or whatever. I don't know why it doesn't feel like it's doing enough, but I may just be kind of thinking that and it, it's not the case. It might just need to be upgraded, honestly. I don't know. And then Radiance we can use if we need to transfer regen. We can also just get the regen on him from Divine Comfort and then transfer that to get even more regen. Like, if somebody's low on health and we use Divine Comfort, we can... And he's high on health, he can use Rallying Cry to to guard that person, give them the additional 30% healing received, and then also copy that regen, which will actually give them even more regen. Because uh, the healing received buff works on the regen. So we'll see if that works out, but... I don't know. I don't know, man. You came here seeking solace found stagnation instead. 
add to existing or replace? I believe it adds to, not it, not replaces. It should it should work like a dot, right? You like where a change in the, the healing from before it'll be added onto, but the healing from before will go like it'll you know it only lasts for three rounds, right? So then it'll go away. My que my question is, I actually don't know how this works. If I only have one turn of regen left on crusader and i transfer it does it start fresh as that amount for three rounds or does it just give the one round of it um in which case then you're almost never going to be able to get the full amount of regen because you won't be able to because he'll have had his round of regen and then transfer it so i don't know how that works um we're gonna have to see how that all how that all plays out i think we definitely want to lean into consecration of light for him we need the extra damage um for smite it just it just needs that little extra bit of oomph i think to really start feeling good yeah one regen like tick but with multiple timers yeah hey already has a gun I mean, there we go. That's a, a good hit. Solution. <laughs> I can use that to stun, I guess. Like, track me shot into disorienting blast if I really need to line something up. We got it this time, y'all. Fortune in memories, long forgotten. Hope everybody's week is going well. Any uh, any good stories from this week, anybody? Any cra any crazy shenanigans going on in y'all's lives? Whoa! Big burp. Sorry. The familiar hearth crackles invitingly once again. All right, let's try this again, huh? Um, invigorating stew pots. Yeah, let's go with that and the Anything rabbit then. Stew pot is good, is man. The cost. Get that extra speed right off the bat. One more week of thing. school before I go home on vacation. Very nice. Hopefully Consider it's not a super position. difficult week for you. Avoid the watchtower for two mastery points. This is a good this is a good start for us, for sure. Spend One more week can tell yeah. Recess. No Woo! Meaning. Time off. If Everybody loves time off. Indeed it ever did. Indeed it ever did. Give everybody a little speed here. We've got two Toon Hummers. Of course, they're Toon Hummers together. Love that for them. Can we get rid of anything here? Let's try, please. Okay. And let's see if we can get rid of Soft here. Oh, nope. Damn it. All right. Hey, you know what? We tried. That was a that was a good start. So, Head in the Sand is definitely a good option for... We have enough if we go to a hospital, so I'm going to keep that One 20 relics. Quickly. When survival demands it. I think I'm going to upgrade Smite and probably Inspiring Cry. Yeah, I could also upgrade Divine Comfort for the additional healing. The only This actually is... It's really only good for him, per se. He has a great way of dealing with his own stress. I'm going to go with uh, Divine Comfort. Lawyers don't have time off, friend. As soon as people know you're a lawyer in some kind of event, they go like, oh, let me ask. I'm sure it's the same for being like a doctor or something like, oh, you're a doctor. Can you take a look at this? Like, no, I can't. <laughs> I'm fucking on vacation. Trying to make visuals for data science class. Ooh, getting messed up because the variables don't line up. Yeah, data science is one of those things that I'm like, I don't know how y'all do that. It's so much just like staring at a screen, trying to figure out the nuances of it all, man. I applaud you for it. Same for social work. Yeah, exactly. Like, oh, you do, you work with blah, blah, blah. Like, oh, you can help me out. It's like, no, you can come pay me to do that during my time where I'm working. But otherwise, fudge, no, you can't. Ha! 
that's a good start. On to the next. Good, like I like that like uh order of operations there. Staring at a screen trying to find the statistical significance for variables, doing predictions, regression models, all that fun stuff. Hey, data science is fascinating. I think it really is. I just don't have the mentality for it. Y'all have some good careers, yo. It's like, all that stuff is fascinating, like I said. It's just like, it's not for me. <laughs> I like doing what I do, where I sit and I, I look at a publication, I build something, I go, I put something together like it's nothing, but all that other stuff, oof, I don't know how you do it. Take two more data science classes next semester, hell yeah. Hey, lead, I'm glad you're leaning into something you love doing. A lot of tokens going on here that I don't like. My concern is that he's going to jump to the front here, yeah, and I won't be able to hit that vulnerable, but we still have the strength here, so it's not terrible. And he does keep that, so he's dead, actually, so that's good. Ow. I think I got rid of Duelist Advance because I didn't think I was going to be using it very often. I might want to switch that away from, like, Wicked Slice or whatever. Because right now, I don't have much going on here. Oh, man. I, you're making me type, dude. Come on, Bate. Come on. Typing. Who does that? Hey, you finally won one. Good job. You proud of yourself? I'm gonna go ahead and heal off that bleed. That's a five bleed that I don't want to deal with. Has been tended to. And now I retire. Ow. Good guard there, though. That's for sure. I'll try to hit her. Very nice. So what I can do here is I can line up a tracking shot because he's got stress, right? So if we're smart here, he's already got a strength token, so that's all, only going to give him one more. We'll get the heal, and then we can do this, and we should get a double stress heal. Very nice. Okay. That's feeling pretty good. Now I've, I've just got to kind of be reprieve. strategic about how I use all that. Until the next test is put before if serrated you. item is equipped, one bleed. If serrated item is equipped, plus 33% bleed resist. So I need to take that and find a serrated item, and then we will be feeling pretty good. I don't have any right now, I don't believe. I don't have any items right now. Okay, we're going to the hospital right off the bat, though, which is good. So we will be able to get rid of that soft quirk, which is nice because soft sucks. Wait, what the fuck? Oh my... Oh, nope, I gotta get rid of Bad Humors. When the fuck did I pick that up? She weeps bad Humors is worse because it's 15% HP versus 5 that Soft is giving her less. So right now she's just... What is she at? 41 health? Yeah, we can get rid of that. Oh, we can get rid of both. Okay, that's good. Well, before I do that, is there anything we absolutely want here? No, I mean, we get rid of Soft, right? We need not be defined by our shortcomings. <laughs> Stinky. Okay, so Junior went from 41 to 49 health there. It's pretty good. Um, there's a fight over here. Most people want to go to the question mark. I'm fine with that. I need mastery points. I need, you know, money. So fights are going to be good for us. Good news, since I prep for family visiting, I now have a functioning guest room. That's good. It's not just a storage space. Proud of you, buddy. That's a good that's a good place to be. Right, I'm gonna start with Zealous here. See if we can get that combo anywhere. Which is gonna be a good place for us to start there. And let's go ahead and line up a double cross. here and then we can get consecration of white going here a lot of setup to make my make Reynold feel super potent here but probably for the worth if he doesn't get 
um, front mortared into being not able to do anything here. Which is always an option with this, but... Then we can line up the next hit for him. I guess I could use Reap, right? It's like an option now. Do I have Reap? I don't have Reap equipped, right? What would Reap do? Does Reap heal or remove stress? It heals when they're comboed. That's, I mean, that's a good ability to have, I think, but this will heal his stress. I've got two, I had two videos that hit 20K. That was just the first one. Both that one and the Warlord video hit 20K right around the same time. It's crazy, I went from having no, I mean, obviously outside of shorts. I've had shorts that have hit 20K before, but I don't really count that because those videos just kind of sometimes they pop off like that, which is great, but it, I don't really see it as like the same kind of level. Um, but yeah, so both of them hit 20k, which is crazy cool. Really, really cool to see that. I'm trying to be consistent with posting videos this, at least this week and next week as much as possible, just because there's definitely momentum right now. Um, which is really cool to see. So, um... I mean, we just go for the kill, right? Like, we don't need to do anything else. Like, I could kill him with him, but it's not really much point. Um, guard. I guess we can guard her. We can mantra here for a nice heal. And then we can hit the back row here. Okay, I'm starting to feel this team out a bit more. I think Templar was definitely the right choice here for for the Crusader. Methodical appliance Aggressor harm. is starting to feel a little weird to me. I don't know. He doesn't... I feel like he needs... I almost feel like the the effects on Aggressor and Wanderer should be changed. Because I... Like, Aggressor feels like... It just feels like it should be as high damage attacks. And that plus 50% damage on combo, I think, feels more a place on his, like, Aggressor path. I get that the burn one is maybe more of like a specialty, so maybe that's why it's on the path, but I don't know. Just me, though. I'm gonna take all these. I don't think Siemens Boots is gonna do much for us. What's. Well, I guess yeah, we can take a look at our speed here. When moving, if speed. Well, we're not really moving anybody, are we? Like, I guess we could move our. We could move him around. Like, he could do Duelist Advance stuff and shenanigans like we want to take off wicked slice to duelist advance and do this like that would work um siemens boots gross i know so gross Haunting powders put on the highwayman for now yeah we don't have a serrated item so i'm really not going to mess around with to get the chirogen's mixing kit though which is good that's a really solid item for us to get i mean food items would be better statistically speaking but hey you know whatever take what we can get do we want point blank shot? I mean, we're not going to be doing much damage with it, right? It's just having a way to move him back could be useful. Even if it's not going to do that much damage, it will line up a combo, which definitely Reynold can take advantage of. So maybe that's a good play for us, even if it's not going to do that much in the way of damage. They revel in debauchery. Debasing themselves in the face of the end. Every bruise, a path to victory. Okay, let's uh, let's take a look at her relationships and see. Uh, Junior or Reynold? Let's go with, or Junior and Dismas. Let's go with Dismas. That way, they won't go into negative. I'll try to be a little smart about my relationships. Hey, it's Quad Baby. Baby fight da 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 da. Baby fight da 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 da. -da. Thankfully, dots don't disappear when the babies do their unstable incubation stuff. I hate those babies. Yeah, they're pretty annoying. The cabin boys. The double block here is a bit irritating. I might just zealous. I don't know. Like, this is only going to do so much damage. I might just zealous here. Kills off the block, gives a little bit of... I'll go for the consecration here. I mean... 
Yeah, it's annoying if these guys do get the transformations off, but... Go try to kill... Usually try to kill two of these guys if I can. Unfortunately, I don't think we'll be able... Well, we actually might be able to do some work here. Who's going first? That one's going... I think we'll be able to kill three here if we're lucky. So we take the high damage one there. And then... Six damage. So we can get this one. That one's now dead. Okay, so we were able to kill three of them. That's pretty good. Please don't disease. Okay, that's that's a lot of health we now have to eat through. <laughs> but oh well. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Dum dum da dum 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 dum. Not the move I meant to do. Whoops. That's fine though. Hopefully he doesn't open make way. Okay. Uh, that's not the worst combination we could get. Definitely not the best, though. Yeah, Bog, he's definitely... We were just talking about this earlier. He's, he's definitely not... He doesn't do that much damage. He's more of a support hero than he is a damage dealer. Um, from what I've kind of found, but if you if you can get a team built around him that can give him the strength he needs, it can definitely be be fine. Malaise. He needs Malaise he needs a little help, steady. but nothing nothing crazy. Good dodge. Like we've definitely been able to get some really good damage out of him. Just needs a little bit of help. The enemy weakens and wins. Yeah, so he's dead. That's great. The mantra here might be able to pop up some relationships by doing something like that. Nice. But yeah, he's definitely, I don't know, he's a little, a little lackluster in the damage department. But again, I don't know if that's really that bad a thing. That's just kind of, that's just kind of a thing. Uh, give her some additional health. The loathing of base. So his Wanderer path, he does a lot of damage. It's a rune up by making a friend. I mean, that's a weird thing to say. <laughs> French people are fine. Nothing wrong with the French. And I'm British, so if anybody's going to say there's something wrong with the French, it would probably be me. I'm Brazilian. Nothing wrong with that either. Would slip I'd love to go to Brazil waters. one day. My dad's been quite a few times. He loves it. In the image of one of his favorite places to go to. Demiurge. All right, who can take the relationship hit with the Paracelsus? Try to keep them out of from going because of the meme. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I mean, yeah. That she at least she doesn't like to retreat, right? I mean, that's uh, that's that's a good a good place for us to look at it. But yeah, definitely, like, getting, whether it's, like, Physician, Plague Doctor, or Consecration of Light, or whatever the case is, like, getting a way to either line up Vulnerable Tokens or Strength Tokens really helps out um, with Raynal, for sure. I'm finding a lot of value with, like, Double Cross and stuff. No, God, let's not start, let's not start wars in the chat. Like, look at that, man. 23 damage, non-crit. Now you can... We, we're starting to get some good damage with him, for sure. You know, I should have just done tracking shot. I don't know why I didn't do tracking shot there. I have tracking shot. Oh, well. You're on the internet, so you're both American. Today, you're American. That's how this works. 12? Yeah, I'll take a 12 hit. Please don't disease. Yeah. Don't eat that corpse. I don't think he can, actually. <laughs> fair enough. I acquiesce. That's fair. Uh, big boom. 
Uh, I'll set up Duelist Advance now. So we can get some trinkets from or tokens from that later. And... He dead. He's dead. So, I don't know. Let's just go for Radiance. Get a little bit of regen, I guess. Kind of counter that bleed a bit. Don't really need it, but, you know. Quad Spider. Mmm, love that for us. Mistimed. Misdirected. Lots of dodge, but we knew that was going to be the case. Based on <laughs> a, a real culture that's based on anything that's not just cheeseburger. I mean, yeah. All right. Trifling matter. It's more based on st Oh god. We're starting arguments in the chat now, y'all. I mean, you're not wrong. Uh, let's do Inspiring Cry. Get that stress down. I'm gonna miss tracking shot here. No, I didn't. Okay, fantastic. We got a little bit of combo lined up there. That's really nice. Well done. A little bit of burn there too. Great. Good kill. This team is starting to shape up for me. It's definitely going to go for the vulnerable, right? No? Okay. Interesting. Take a little bit of damage there. Not much. Stole London tacos. The tacos are good, though. I had some tacos from a food truck today. They were very good. Oop, wrong, wrong button there. getting that stress reduction where I can. Templar always seems to end with, like, full health. It's kind of silly. It's silly in a good way. It's just like, damn. Dude's, dude's got all of his health left. And be off once more. And be off once more. I'm kind of tempted to take off Radiance and switch it for Reap. Once we get Reap upgraded, I might even take it just for the Evangelists and stuff as well when we get there, because uh, the healing is a, is definitely a thing that we can... I trust you have calculated your odds carefully. What does Templar do? Uh, Templar is kind easy. of his tank path. It's kind of a self-sustained tank path, even though we're not using Bulwark of Faith, which we probably should be on this path, but his smite when combo will reduce stress. When upgraded, it's minus two, and it's just one on regular. Uh, his reap when upgraded will heal him on combo, which is really potent. Um, and then what is the other one it changes? Rallying Cry. So Rallying Cry will give a target guard. It'll guard somebody. It gives them additional healing received. And then it will also transfer his regen if they're below a health threshold. And when it's upgraded, it'll copy the regen. So he gets to keep his regen. It's really good for getting somebody like off of death's door who's like at a risk. Um, being able to get the regen onto somebody can also like counteract dots if you're lucky with it, especially with the additional healing received. You can actually like counteract damage over time if they're about to go. So that could be really potent. But you'd have to like get pretty lucky with the amounts. An inglorious heap of rotting timbers. Um, alright. So I'm just gonna line up double crosses here. Cause I or not. Okay. That's fine. A slow dissection. I think we should be able to do enough damage back here. It's fine, we have Duelist Advance, so I'm not super worried about it. Yeah, that's good damage, man. This is not a good place for us to be in, but I guess if she gets moved back, then not that big a deal. Of course we get the blind, so that's super cool. The movement here is annoying. And that doesn't line us up very well at all. Okay. Well, we have Repulse, so that's useful. Steady and that's going to move him. Okay. And that's going to stun him. All right. Good job, video game. You got me there. 
Go ahead and stealth her. Crisis. We can She's got that vulnerable token. I really don't want to take a hit here. Smallpox? Oh my god. One of the rarest diseases in the game. Are you serious? Did he get stunned again? Or did he... Hey, he got stunned again. Was he dazed and then smallpox procced? I don't know what just happened. Okay. Malaise. Measured and steady. The fiend you can't dwindles. double stun somebody, so I don't know how he got stunned again. Oh well. Um. A steady subtraction. An no, because he result. he was he would have had a round a turn last turn. He definitely got double stunned I, or stunned again at, on his turn. Somehow I'm guessing he was dazed by something. I don't know. We're gonna have to figure out that disease. That's gonna be a problem for us, unfortunately. Daisy in the beginning of each turn. Yeah, I mean, it's it's not the worst one he could have gotten, I guess. Definitely not good, though. So, like, with that five regen, I could, like, transfer that. To, you can get some pretty silly regen numbers if you're smart about it. The work continues. Um... No. Who gave you smallpox? The the baby gave it when they did their transformation. It's one of the most potent disease giving moves in the game is unstable transformation or whatever it is. And, you know, it's freaking annoying, dude. Good job, Pate. The loathing whispers. Our relationships are also not very good right now. This has not been a good region for us. I'm not going to lie. We are. We like don't have any trinkets. We don't have any mastery points. All of our relationships are taking hits here. Abandoned or forgotten. Um, it is ours yeah, we've gotten one mastery from this. We're going to get two because we avoided. We did avoid the watchtower, right? Yeah, we're going to get two for watching, avoiding the watchtower, which is good. Um, Analysis is invaluable. Until it becomes an excuse for him actually. But we'll have to see how this how this shapes up. Just tagging me and stuff. What? What? I get tagged in the weirdest stuff in the darkest dungeon Discord. I swear. I also don't understand how the new. <laughs> I don't understand how the new. I don't, like, how can I see where I got tagged? A new Discord is using to me. Oh, it's a silly thing. It's a silly thing. All right. Okay. Um. Yeah, we're going to get bled here. I'm going to put this on him so he can do the stress heal here. We'll double cross here. Get the vulnerable lined up if we can. Burn there. Let's go for that flying hit here. Crit. We've been getting a lot of crits. <laughs> Very annoying. Uh, go for consecration. He may do what he had in hand, yeah. His uh, his trinkets are crazy, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna do this and this. That's feeling pretty good, man. 
Not gonna lie, that's a that's a pretty good combination going on there. Our tight, yeah, his animations are really good. A simple variable, easily resolved. Goodbye. Angus, their usual suspect challenge or something seems to be the same comp Shuff is using. Uh, no, it's not a challenge. It's just, um... There's an achievement for it. And we, we both happen to have been, like, playing other teams for the last couple days, and then I guess today we both decided to play this. I've been thinking about doing this for, like, two days now, and I, I started streaming today, and I was like, oh, I'll check out who else is on right now. Is Shuff on? And I saw him, and I was like, oh, he's also doing the, the usual suspects. What the hell? <laughs> Uh, but no, there's an achievement for doing this. Um, uh, minor Heart Seeker is really, really not great. It's really not that great, honestly. All right, uh, let's take a look at our items, make sure we got anything going on here. So these clotting powders are going to be really good for us uh, in this fight. Uh, we can stack that up. All right, let's go for it. Trinkets? What about trinkets? It's on him. This one's... Yeah, I, I just said I wasn't going to put it on because of the, uh, the minus healing on it is, uh, is just too much for me right now, honestly. You watch soccer, BB? Uh, no. I should though. I like. I would love to watch more, but I I don't. Uh, you fucking asshole. <laughs> you moved the vulnerable out of my target range for Crusader. That would have been a good hit. Oh well. This harmony is fine. Go ahead and use this here. Which team you cheer for? I usually cheer for uh, Man United. That's been my team I've supported since I was young. So if I'm gonna pick a team, that would be it. But. Uh, those 23 hits are nice. Ah, cowardice. Correct. That's a thing. Relief comes rarely in Annoying. Times. Savor it. That's going to be hard to get out of without just force moving somebody. Which I'm going to have to do here, huh? Oh. Oh, oh that's actual cowardice working there. What path is Crusader? He is Templar. Templar path, baby. Let's look at the kill and the burn. Oh my god. Why is this procking so much? It's procked on like everybody so far. Poor Vestal. He's like, I don't want to be here, bro. Like, get, get me the fuck out of this hellhole up here. What's the blight back here? Nine. Yeah, should be enough to finish him off pretty soon. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and get the mind comfort going. Radiance. Crit token's gonna hurt. Dead. Oh my god. His actual cowardice is causing us a lot of problems right now. And I can already see this being an issue on the final fight. Um... Because we've had that issue of cowardice doing this before. And completely wrecking us on that fight. Hey, Cyclops, how's it going? I 
I just thought it low enough for that healing to transfer, so. Malaise. Measured and steady. Can I leave now? <laughs> Please don't push him back. Okay, there we go. Now we've got... That was fun. The work we double continues. resisted the bleed there, so... Don't actually follow footy. Yeah, I really don't follow it. I should follow it, but I don't. Like, all my, all my family follows it, you know? And and whatnot, but... I'm honestly fine with this. Well, actually, no, I'm not. I need to get rid of smallpox. I'm gonna do that. The minus 20% health on him. Normally, I'd be fine with that, because he, he does really well with speed. But... Uh, this is too much for him right now. That's that's already drastically kicking his, his health down. We're doing... We've got minus eight from Cork there. Ugh. And uh, I mean, nothing is going to cure him at this hospital... At this, uh... What path is Vestal? She's Seraph. That's Seraph, Alchemist, Yellowhand, Templar. Ow. Thanks, Gonzalez. I appreciate that. Lower your guard. Ugh. Soften Bulbous your Venom Gland gave us a mastery point. All trinkets it are discounted. Two mastery points from Fog of War. We get Bon Viv and Recounter. Recounter can be good for us. That show in chat, it did for me. I actually got scared with that. We do get the unique Reliquary here, which is interesting. So, um, Invigorating Stew everybody eats up uh, we want to stack food otherwise relics remind us of a time let's see what do we got here end. i mean blueprint tubes is going to give us more food items but i don't really care for more food items mortar and pestle could be good um we've already got the more restorative items this is where i wish we had the owl right because this is like this is all tinkerer's gear that could be really good for us. A say gear is always a good bet. Um, all right, let's um, let's take a look at relationships before we get too crazy here, because I think everybody's fairly negative. I think we can fix at least get the Experience. relationships out of negative with is the greatest teacher of um, all. with some in items which will be good for us so we can use the whiskey here to at least get two of them out of the that is paracelsus and dismus and junior and dismus let's try that they can use this right yeah i should have checked that first okay i think most of these everybody is actually going to be pretty good look at this yeah everybody is above zero zero percent chance for negative because of our got a couple good like relationship things going on here which is nice can we get rid of coward that's causing us some problems we cannot we can't get rid of coward okay that's fine um let's take a look at where we can go huh consider your position and plan accordingly. general is not a good hit fit with this I I don't know. I think, did they change Illumination recently? I think Illumination won't. You can't use it against the back row unless... You can't use it against the target unless they have dodge or stealth. Sorry for being a coward friend. It's okay. I still love you. So I, I don't think we're going to get much value out of that. Um, as far as the general. The other fight was what? The Fetter? The next stop is leagues away. Um, Plan accordingly. We could probably do the baby. I mean, I don't see why we couldn't do the baby. It's just not going to be like a... It's not going to be a shutout, right? I'm going to have to hope for some big hits. Big hits. Hmm. We've already eaten, so I don't need to worry about food. Yeah, we can stack up the bleed resist on the front two ranks. Um, 
There's a cat screaming at the... Oh, they're gonna get fed, that's why. I, and I really need to get rid of this small box, but probably not gonna happen. I'm gonna give healing received to our friend here. Um, I don't have any serrated items. I don't think none of these are serrated, right? I don't have any other combat items that are serrated, like hiding. Sometimes I forget that I have one. I'm gonna go ahead and grab, we're gonna try, I mean, we're gonna aim for doing the baby, right? Throw clotting powders on the front two here, just to increase the chances that they don't get bled. Um, I'm gonna increase the Consecration of Light, because that one's gonna be really potent for us on our Crusader. Inspiring Cry is probably going to be one that we want to look at upgrading. Open Vein for the Bleed is going to be really good for us. Double Cross has also given us a lot of value. I'm totally open to Double Cross. IS for the Hunger Removal. And... I don't think we need to worry about dodge too much. Which skill removes hunger? Uh, upgraded Indiscriminate Science will remove all negative tokens. Hunger counts as a negative token. It is not a special negative token like the uh, Winded on Hellion. Um, so it is a pretty, pretty dang good option. Maybe play Grenade. I mean, the thing is, like, I probably shouldn't be too reliant on... Is it Adderall? I don't know what it is, but it's fucking good, whatever it is. Upgraded Judgment for the damage. Upgraded Mantra for the healing... Zealous Accusation for the additional burn and combo generation. We're not really using it that much, though. Duelist Advance. Sure, why not Duelist Advance? We'll go with that. Oh, we do have Debuff Resist here. This could actually be really good for us um, on that. 50% Debuff Resist right there. That's pretty good. I mean, it at least makes it a coin flip, so it's not, like, terrible if, uh, if he does get hit. I need to find a hospital, <laughs> because smallpox is going to absolutely wreck our shit. Wreck our shit. All right. Um, oh, here we go again. <laughs> That's funny. That's a funny line. He's like, the nope, farms and fuck, fields of it's happening again. Overrun with putrescence and rot. You'll never find me wielding a dull blade. No, I shall not. Okay. All right. Let's do this. One relationship. Respectful. Tried and tested. A bomb Inspiring to cry will go strength. Mag rain will go strength. Mag rain is actually not a bad option for us. Especially as another option to give strength to Raynal, which is going to be pretty potent. Sure, I'll swap to mag rain. I'm more than happy to swap the to mag. Smop, smit, smop. Alright, let's take a look at where... We're going to go here. We do have a formless sculpture that can give us. I've never heard that whispering before. What the fuck? Are you guys hearing that? No? Of course, god damn it, Pate. Uh you you trickster, you little you little trickster. Okay, we can go any direction up until this point. Tempted to take this left route. Because we kinda know what's here. We know it's fights, which is good. Because it's less likely we're you know is trying to get with armor and, and wheels as far as we can, so. 
You, 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 you little, you little asshole. Jesus Christ, are you serious? 5% chance, video game. Oh my god. First move of the fucking fight in the fucking region. Well, that's fucking shit. Hits a crit through that, but at least we resisted the bleeds. That's good. Oh my god. Are you serious? What just happened right there? Was that Crusader that did that? Yeah, it's round start. Oh my god. 5% chance he did it twice in a row. The double one, not just the one move. Fucking hell, Ray. Get your shit figured out. Ugh. Yeah, this shit. Yeah, I might want to throw a fucking Holy Land on him. You're not wrong. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Man. I'm scared. You should be scared. A one in four hundred chance, I think. Fuck yeah, swag. I got those. I got those odds. It's a dodge and it's repost. Why have I never noticed that before? At least never paid attention to it. Analysis I don't get to see it for boss, which is annoying. To action. Goodbye, tokens. Matt checks a out, yeah. Taught is a lesson learned. Oh. Better land something, because it's going to suck otherwise. That was, that was fun. That was a good, it was a good start. Hello, gnarly knuckles. Don't mind if I do. All right, at least Ray is going to be hitting relatively hard, relatively consistently. Familiar desk. Why was I ever chosen for this terrifying quest? Don't know. What quirk was that? I don't know. That was. It said it was a quirk. All out. Missives, letters, notes. What knowledge awaits us? There is something thrilling about reading others' letters. Mm -hmm. a little. The a little naughty there. Eager to fly uh, his trade. Almanac for the tangle. Yeah, sure, could be good. Everybody wants to go to the thing in the corner. But I kind of want to go to the unknown because we know it's a fight. Will it still be the usual suspects? Uh, I mean, it doesn't like. 
I put Dismas in rank one. Technically, no, it would be a different team, but like, it's still the same four heroes. Like, it really doesn't make a difference. Like, if I flip Paracelsus and Junior, it's called Red Hook. I can't remember what the. I think they're all named, no matter what the combination. I just don't remember what they all are. So it would not still be the usual suspects, no. But like, it. I mean, does it really make a difference? Yeah, it's kind of kind of debatable. Letters about titties. I mean, yeah. Do you get the achievement? Yes, you get the achievement. You the the achievement is only for taking these four. It's not for playing this exact combination. I should say. Hey, Darth, just how's it going? A slow suffering begins. So if we go see the achievement, it is. I think it's called the gangs all here or some or for old time's sakes. Oh no, it has to be the usual suspects. I don't know then. I don't know if you have to. I think maybe you just have to leave the inn or leave the crossroads of the universe. I don't know. That's interesting. I'm wondering how this, like, calculates. Because I thought it was just for playing with the four of them, but... Hmm. How have I not gotten this hard? It's weird, because I have this unlocked on my Steam profile, but I don't have it unlocked on this profile. I'm, I think it probably transferred from my... Back when they were all bugged out. I might have to like, manually add that one. The fiend's strength dwindles. Resist. Good double resist there. Very nice. Man, these guys are proccing their blights a lot for their ordainment. Jester would definitely be, I think, a good fit for this team. Encore would feel really good with, with a lot of what's going on here. Do, 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 do. Lots of resists. You'll love to see it. I don't know why I did that. I should have done double cross, not that. Dodge it. Damn it. But this should still line up a kill. Uh, ordained enemy. Doing ordained enemy shit. Uh, whatever. Doesn't matter what we do here. Oh, god damn it. The smallest variable can make all the Ugh. difference. All right. This team is good. It's feeling good. We just need to get rid of the small box. This is going to cause us so many problems, man. I mean, there's a high likelihood that there's a hospital here, but I we haven't scouted one and I don't see one, so. There's not many other ways to get rid of diseases. Like if there was a Kyrogen's table, we could do we could do that. I don't see one. We're trying to head towards the lair, right? Did we already miss the lair? Where's the lair? Wait. Oh, it's over. I mistook that for the lair. Uh. We're we're okay. We're still good. We just have to stick to the left here. We can go to the hoarder if we wanted to. How we're doing on money? Not really well enough to go to the hoarder, I don't think. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll take the... Right, let's see, relationship-wise, who can take the hit more. Paracelsus is... More with this one. Let's go with this one. It'll still hit them down to negative or to, like, out of the 
neutral, but it won't be as bad of a hit, so that's that's good. Uh, we should probably just go Warhorn here. I can't track any shot, which is annoying, but we can Enough still remove the dodge. Squandered. Malaise. Fortunately, this crate is gonna hit. And steady. Which is annoying. God damn it. But deadly all the same. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this on now, because we're gonna get a lot of dots supplied to us with this team. A lot of bleed and a lot of um, other nastiness I'd rather just not deal with, so. Fucking hell. Dude, this ability is... This smallpox is absolutely fucking me right now. This is so annoying, dude. Where are they getting all these crit tokens for all oh, from the ordainment? Ugh. And now we're back in this position again, because fucking why wouldn't we be? Dude, I'm getting sick of this fucking small box. This is one of the worst diseases in the game. And you know, because it's 5%, it's going to proc like every turn it gets. Why is Holy Ranch lanes ranged? Because it, it's... The, the, the dev's choice to make it range? I don't know. Don't ask me. <laughs> I didn't make it that way. It just is. The argument is probably that the actual sword itself isn't hitting. It's the flaming fucking, you know, magic that's going around it. So, I don't know. That's probably their argument. Whether or not that's a legit argument or not, I don't know. Good dodge. Nox, don't think about it. Get off. I can see you a thinking about jumping variable, up there. Easily resolved. Crit token. A yes, it's yellow hand. Response. Team's cat time. No, he's you he's gonna yet. sit down there for now. Judgment did, did. There we go. Oh, fudge. I thought we were done. We were not. Whoops a daisy. Yellow Hand is a better pairing for Dancer Crusader than other paths, though Wonder. I honestly think Wonder is probably the best um, because it really gives you the ability to swap up um, ranged and melee. Like, yeah, it's not going to do as potent damage with either of them, but it's still going to do reliable damage with both, which I think is important. Um... And he's stunned. Yep. Uh, come on, big guy. The game, I feel, I really feel like the game's AI has gotten a bit smarter very recently. I'm not sure they've made changes, but the focus fire from enemies recently feels a lot 
better, which is better for the game, don't get me wrong. It's just annoying because I don't want to die. A steady subtraction, an invariable result. So the enemies are focused dudes more. Yeah, and Shuffle's also made a comment about it. I don't know if that's just, you know, perception bias or, you know, whatever you want to call it, but it feels like something has changed a little bit. I'm just not sure quite what that is. Your I'm not sure how this spider ends up going. This is so annoying. <laughs> I might really need to put on Holy Lands to deal with this because this is just just silly at this point. I don't think we can take on the baby man. Like this is just gonna absolutely. The only thing I can think of is it because these are like round start things. Uh, like it may actually come in beneficial for the baby, like in ignoring hunger, <laughs> which is kind of a really roundabout like thing. But like, I guess if it if it procs before the hunger does and it just shoves them back. This is no um, place yeah, Coward is like, so he, his smallpox is pushing him back and then Coward is just immediately doing the same thing. It's like, oh my god. The it's just Dismas and Ray can't stand to be apart from one another, so every time uh, Raynal gets shoved back because of smallpox, which seems like a, such a weird side effect of smallpox. I don't understand how that, like, makes sense. Whatever. Uh, he's like, no, I've, I've got to run back with you. And be humbled by it. Um... I don't need that. Let's just take the scouting, I guess. Yeah, I just need all of those, like, dancing things. Do we have a hospital opportunity? We do not. Okay, so no hospital. We're kind of stuck with it. <laughs> when deliberation is exhausted, do we have anything that the... We really can't afford the, uh, the hoarder, man. I guess this way is actually better, because... We can lower loathing here. We'll gain one. We'll lower one. And then that way we're not reducing any armor or wheels. So we'll be best prepared for the fight. Or better prepared for the fight. Full inventory dancing team. Yeah. Full quirk dancing team. Could be pretty funny. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. That would be free crocodilian proc crocs. It would be pretty funny if like... Oh, okay. We switched to bad humors. No, we just got bad. Oh my god. What is going on with this team? I thought was, I got the, the mixed up there. <sighs> Okay. Any being, however horrid, can be brought to you. Wish I had illumination here. Sometimes 
Sometimes I laugh at this game, man. I'm getting darkest dungeons to the ult to the penultimate right now of all this, of all these shenanigans. But it is what it is, I suppose. Um, one sec, I'm trying to see something right now, but it's not working. There it is. Want to see who up darkesting their dungeons? I'm just trying to see who's live right now. Always interesting to see. There's a lot of people streaming right now, which is good to see. Got my flagellant killed from 100% health on three hits. Yeah. I love that too. Darkest Dungeon is such a fun game. But man, if you can make this work, then you can make anything work. Impede us and no vengeance. Ooh, I like that line. That's that's a good line. Uh, I'm not going to... I'm trying to save these combat items because, like, you know. But we'll see. 90% DBR resist is a myth. The higher the DBR resist, the more of a myth it is. I still am amazed that we had... We had a Plague Doctor survive six death door checks in a row two days... Or a couple days ago. I was absolutely astounded. I, I, ne I was like, what in the hell is happening right now? Uh, okay. Oh, hi, Blind. Okay, I got confused there for a second. Thank you for the 400 bitties there. And yes, Twitch adding 40 of its own bits there because of the, uh... uh so it's doubling it. That's funny. So yeah, Twitch is uh, doing 10% of bits they're adding on. So anytime you get bits, you get an additional 10% added on. So thank you for the bit, Cyclops. I appreciate it. And you're really cool. That's very kind of you. That's cool to see. Uh, it's been a long time since Twitch has done one of these bit things. So this is the end of your bonus round. So subs, I think, are on discount. And also uh, bits are... Uh, you get extra bits as well. So if you do want to support that way, um, be super appreciated. The classic unkillable character while using Bumper Crop and Dark Temptation. Yes. Those are those are definitely things you should be using on that character. Feeding time. Poor Dismas. He's like, dude, this is fucking okay. Okay. That's fine. Everything's fine. Breath should not be spammable. Fucking hell. Thank God for Sanguine. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of the stress now. Getting a lot of double cross value for sure. Double Cross really helping us out here. Any being, however horrid, can be brought to you. Well, like, we're getting good value out of that, for sure. Like, Smite is hitting pretty hard now. No gain is Definitely hitting as hard as I want it to hit for, like, what it should be, the in my opinion. Whispers. All right, we're gonna go for this fight because we are trying to go towards the lair. It's really our best option you right now. Fight so that because otherwise, our only options are gonna be, um, like Librarian is not. Uh, librarian is doable with this team, it, I guess. Festers. Um, with Paracelsus, you can kind of make it work. Like Paracelsus combined with like upgraded tracking shot would definitely be a good. Like we could just nail in the damage. And even with Illumination as well, like between the two of them, we'd be able to land enough lights that he'd probably be pretty them, weak by the time and so he got up there. But, uh, I always know when to run. Yeah, you're fine. Everybody's fine. Who cares about your relationships? Okay, it's not the elite version of this guy. The elite version of this guy has been throwing me for a freaking loop recently. Okay, 
Okay, so now we got a lot of vulnerable to play, which is really good. How much damage we can do here? Not enough to kill, but probably enough to kill here, so we'll go for that one. Even though this one is ordained. Now we're fighting dirty. Alright. That four blight on that attack is always wild to me. Wow, feast, get the regen. No, no, the heal, not the regen. talking damage 24 damage with the vulnerable solution. and the strength there remove the corpses pull them forward uh, let's get the mind comfort going getting a lot of value out of that bleed resist for sure Oh well. The enemy weakens and wanes. Five damage there. We can probably do enough damage to Zealous here to just cause him to die. There we go. A simple variable. Maybe I should have gone with the heal there, but oh well. I think we're in good shape. I still don't know how we're gonna do against the baby, but I think we're in okay shape. A barricade coming up. All right, as long as it's not a warlord. We've said that before. I'm gonna have to probably use these bleed resist uh, items though, as much as I wish I didn't have to. Um, but. Yeah. Um, I trust you have calculated your no warlord yet. Carefully. I mean, this we could definitely have him spawn easy. here. <laughs> Woo, all right. <laughs> a titan of rusted metal, a juggernaut. Not the time, buddy. Dismemberment. Fuck, dude. I mean, it's good that we do have some bleed resist going on right now. Yeah. Thankfully, Blight is also a very good a good fit against him. We're probably not going to take the baby on here, but this guy does drop some really good trinkets. So if we can make this work for us, it can be good. That's twice now that's happened, by the way. Is that going to crit? Oh, that's fine. For a crit, that's fine. I'm glad that that consumes his crit. That's awesome for us. A slow dissection. Jesus and Christ. This is really not the time for this, buddy. No, he cannot appear only when the Crusader's on the team. You do have to unlock the Crusader and defeat all of the Crusader's um, uh shrines in order for him to start spawning randomly so that is something you need to do this is no time to falter who's calling me right now dad Yeah, he's immune to bleed, so that's really not going to do anything to me. Fuck. The greatest I don't have a heal for him, man. I mean, he's going to heal himself, but this is... Okay, we do have a heal for him. Like, this is so annoying. I keep ending up with her up front because of the fucking... All the shit that he's dealing with. Um, all right, I'm going to give him this again, and we're just going to slam into here. Get the stress resist. He never shows. Uh, he's at like 5% chance to show at a military barricade in the first region. I think it's 15% in the second region, and I think it's 20 or 25% in the last region. He can only show up once per uh, run, so you won't get him multiple times. 
Um, it is fairly high, yeah. Shit, dude. This is so fucking annoying. I can't get my ca fucking characters where they need to be. It's so fucking annoying, dude. This fucking thing, dude. Okay, that should burn this, and then that's now that's gonna die, which is good. We're also gonna get a unique um, cork from this fight as well. If you if we defeat him, like that's obviously a big if, right? But getting a, we're gonna get a lot of value out of double cross for that. Um, that block removal for sure. That's gonna be really good for us. You get a cork called Vanquisher, which gives you uh, a heal every time you kill, every land a killing blow. A pretty damn potent uh, cork. There we go. All right. Did we resist the disease there? Interesting. Yeah, it's a, it's a pretty cool quirk. It's not like super busted or anything. I, I mean, we managed this fairly well. It's annoying that we've had to jump back and forth 400 times. Why did I get a healing proc there? Do you see that? Made it look like I was going to heal somehow. Oh, he's got Vanquisher. Okay. So that might show that that's going to show the heal, which is interesting. Lenity. Great. Small act that drive back the darkness. A brilliant conclusion. <sighs> I mean, it could be good for play, though. I wonder if it proc off our dots. I doubt it. Amidst the spoils. All right, so a couple interesting things here. Power. We get uh, Gallia, which is round star ally behind. He will guard each hero on turn end. If guarded, gets strength, crit, or speed. So that's pretty good. If we had another guard, like it almost is valuable to use Sanctuary here for the, the additional guard because it doesn't apply to just his guard. It applies to anybody's guard, right? Um, we also get the Tropeum. So this is a reusable combat item, which is a very interesting thing. So this is a combat item of a cooldown um, that adds a combo token to somebody. So if you need combo generation, um, you can get some value out of it. This is really good for things like stunning blow. Any stuns, this is really good. If you want to line up a stun like immediately, you can. Um, it's a pretty damn good trinket or combat item sorry it's basically a trinket but it's like a usable trinket this is something that i really hope the devs like implement more of um i would love to see them implement more of this for sure man i don't know if taking off that debuff resist is a good idea though like the 20 percent damage is really good as well Combo and command reusable is so good for certain skills. Yeah, it's very, very potent for sure. I, mean, I think we have to do this, right? Probably better than this. I mean, we can, we're still doing a lot of melee damage here, so we're still going to get a lot of value out of that, right? I am a little worried about taking off um holy lance though i think we're gonna do the bird has the cork everybody misreads what clotter or fussy eater oh yeah F yeah Fuss fussy eater yeah oh my god hi oh my god hi thing on how's it going Foul i forgot the shelby out of that command <laughs> Foul tidings. no right. doubt the source is within um 
I'm actually going to take this over the clotting powder. These guys are pretty resistant up front. Resistant enough that I'm not super worried about it. I always say, oh my god, hi. Well, there you go. There's there's an oh my god, hi moment right there. I'm going to do this for the speed. I don't think we have any serrated items, so I'm not going to worry about that. All right. Let's see how we do against the Harvest Child. The sturdy man. enemy. Sturdy do Butcher is a, is a really nasty combination. For sure. Um, starting off with a crit token here. He's guarded now. Wait, why did he get a crit token? Each hero on turn end, if target has guard strength, why did, but why did he get a crit token? Oh, is that from Whetstone? Probably from Whetstone. Okay. Can't believe this fishing. Yeah, the fishing has been a little rough for you, huh? You got another crit token there. I'm confused. Am I am I reading this right? Is this giving crit to him or is it giving should it be giving crit to or did he just Each hero on turn end. It's not his turn end yet, so he's not guarding anybody. I don't know where that he's gotten double. Oh, consecration of light. I'm a fucking idiot, dude. Sorry, excuse me. <laughs> Honestly, the moving around here could actually be really potent for us. It's going to swap the guard there. Oh, my God. Okay, not that potent. <laughs> a run in which every skill was... but Yeah, yeah, I remember him talking about that. It was, a, it was a nightmare for him, dude. Glad I kept Holy Lance. I'm going to turn this into a, a positive for us. This whole smallpox thing, if I can. Nightmare for him, fun for you, yeah. Oh, he gets the heal for killing a corpse. Oh, that's good to know. <laughs> it, it, he probably shouldn't. <laughs> They've already taken a lot of the corpse clear kills out. I should probably report that. <laughs> Lethality writ large. That's funny though. Wait, why did she get guard again? She got another guard token there. That shouldn't happen. I don't know what's happening here. This is funny though. This this trinket is fucking wild, dude. Yeah, if you have aggressor, he takes he gets the stress reduction. Um, well, no, he doesn't. Templar gets stress reduction. Does does aggressor aggressor gets stress reduction on one of his moves? I think. I think. Oh, I think it's if they're burned and comboed, right? He gets a heal, and I can't remember how it works. So I just want to see this operate. So adds the combo, and then bam. I mean, that would have been a stun, but. A petty hindrance. Very interesting. Oh my fucking god, dude. Crazy. Aggressor takes stress reduction on... Kill, I think. Yeah, it's something like that. Okay, this is just... The amount of movement this team is doing right now is just fucking goofy. I'm gonna go for the kill instead of the, uh, the stun.
No, it's dead. The smallest variable can make all the difference. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, that's so good. So the spear enemies fix your positioning? Shroud enemy. Oh, oh, right, right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. Boom! Fucking hell. What is it then? That gazes back so intently. Is everything the bounty hunter wants? Yeah. This is this is just funny, dude. Is what this is. I love this. All right. Can we take on the baby? I don't know. But this this trinket is goofy. Of course, we get profane profane scroll. Brilliant Brew is good here. Bumper Crop is great. Ghastly Gruel is very good. All right, we get some good trinkets out of this. Let's do it. Well, I'm glad we found the Warlord. Born to a corpulent, half-eaten mother, the child is a ravenous avatar of degeneracy. <laughs> yeah, that's his stomach. Yeah. For that, uh, that for that particular uh, thing. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty gruesome. Oh, the guard. Hmm. Not exactly what you want there, but that's fine. Boom! Get out of here. Disturbing. It's a very disturbing enemy, absolutely. I agree. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't even know what we got. Oh, we got the combo from Point Blank Shot. Excuse me? Wait, what just happened? How did... How did we get Hunger on Crusader there? That, lo that was weird. Was that a guarding thing? I think that was a guard gone wrong. I believe that's what that was. Only seven damage. How does that line up? Okay, that's fine. Lethality writ large. That one's not gonna last very long, is it? He's coming out of. This is a. It's got like, I don't know. I don't want to think about it too much. It's a cornucopia that he's coming out of, yeah. It's, it's it's supposed to be like, you know, Cornucopia is supposed to be like the thing about like abundance of food and things like that. And it's they've twisted that onto it, it being a, just a sick thing. Wow, these tri this trinket combination we got going on is just melted whatever is happening here. Good hour pause. It's a gross fight, man. It's this whole area is really gross.
Symbol of, oh my god, of course we got double hunger there. That's fucking annoying, dude. It's gonna, that's hit our relationship up pretty bad, I think, but that's okay. Alright, we're gonna be fine here. Let's, let's go ahead and get a heal. A small foundation of trust. It was one of the. It's it's a very fun re like I absolutely agree. I think it, I think it's a really good region. I think it's gross, but like that's it's viscerally gross, which is like kind of the point, right? It's not meant to be fun. Thanks for giving us another heal there. Hell yeah. Okay, this is this is quickly becoming a goofy run in the best of ways, and I'm loving it. All right, let's take a look at items here. I mean, Ghastly Gruel goes well here. We're not using Profane Scroll. Brilliant Brew, I think, is really good. We'll go ahead and throw that on. The Shrine Map, we can get rid of. It's not going to do anything for us. We'll definitely keep the food item for sure. That's going to be hope very nice. Drop those Neutralizing... Uh, we can keep the Neutralizing Powders. I guess they're probably just as good as the Holy Water in this region, honestly. And these Seaman's Gloves... Or fishmonger's gloves. I don't know. Maybe not the best value. Right now, because we're moving around so much, we're getting a lot of value out of the boots. Thin line between hating your run and having fun with it. Yeah, exactly. A simple choice. At least it this, I mean, be. this, yeah, the sluice is very thinned out, right? I mean, that's kind of, it's part of its appeal, I suppose. I would love if there were, like, some very rare special interactions in the sluice. I think there could be a lot of fun there. Alright. This is gonna take us to a fight, it's fine. Well, we fought the Warlord now, so we know that that fight can no longer spawn for us, but we can get a Collector. So that is something to keep in mind. Um, collector can definitely come and cause some problems. We don't have really any way of dealing with him. We have no way of moving him, itself. per se. I'm going to throw in Disorienting Blast. I just want to be cautious of a Collector spawning. It's unlikely, but... I haven't had a Collector spawn in quite some time, so... He is going to take a lot of damage, just being that he's taking... You know, a lot of these hits right now, so something to keep in mind. Yeah, yeah, the trinkets there definitely feel a little lackluster. I do agree. I think, um, I hope they get some rework. They're, they're, I understand them, like, why low light trinkets are a thing. Like, I think they should be a thing for sure, but they definitely need some help. Okay, her being moved up here definitely helps us. Okay, we should resist the bleed, though, which is good. Hopefully we don't get front mortared here. That's good. Okay, Ray feeling a little rough for wear, but that regen helping him out here. Go ahead and do this opening for the stun is so nice for us. Oh, that's such a good item. Holy crap. I feel like I'm in DD1. <laughs> getting very lucky here unfortunately it's not gonna last because he's gonna keep doing that so as long as this person doesn't hit him which i don't think they will okay you may outwit them we'll be okay here uh heal there and then heal here all right get rid of that guy we should probably think about putting Radiance back on him. Like, a way for him to get um, regen right now is going to be good for him. Because he's he's taking a lot of extra abuse because of the constant guard. But, like, it's fine. It's just going to be kind of scary for a little bit. God, that's crazy, dude. I, 
I think this trinket's gonna get nerfed, man. This is can make all the difference. This is silly. Dude, it's almost worth it to put it on Dismas for the repost value. More than it is to put it on Reynold. I I mean I don't know if that's valid or not, but If you get the Vanquisher one on an Aggressor Crusader, dude, the potent like, he's just gonna keep himself alive as long as you can kill things. Like, he's just unkillable to a degree. Craziness. There's some strength tokens there, I will take those. Of course, the downside to this, this combat item is that, like, you know, it takes up a slot, right? So, like, you're... You're gonna have to deal with that, but like, whatever, man. <laughs> I love the idea of these like buildings, like so you can tell this is like the top of one of the Oblivion's uh, ramparts. And it's like the idea of them just like coming out of a portal in the ground slowly, like infecting the land. It's such a cool like idea. Yes, there is. Her Wanderer Path heals herself on, not on Repost Kill, just on Repost. Her, um, that gives like a, t a, a blanket heal 33% chance to happen, I believe it is. And then she has her, I think it's her Antagon, no, it's her Instructrice Path, I believe. That gives her, yeah, Instructrice gives her a regen on Aggressive Path when she gets a Killing Blow. That's what it is. May finish the work. I usually feel the Wonder Duelist is that Wonder Duelist is really good, and it's it's a great example of making the Wanderer paths feel like distinct paths and distinct like ways to play the heroes, which I do hope that they kind of lean into in the future when they do their rebalancing and stuff. Wonder Flag also feels really good, yeah. The Smallpox proc days here, so. More and more equals MVP. It really is an MVP move, absolutely. Unfortunate crit, but he resisted both of them. God damn, dude. here. Unhelp there was so by Oh my gosh, she helped. The, li the little miss on the screen, yeah. Scorch from 95% heal with Deathless is fairly funny, yeah. Flag, Flag is just feeling really good as a, as a character overall. Um, I think he's a lot of fun. I definitely... What I love about the development cycle of this game is that it, it's apparent that they have, like, matured their development process for this game over time. Um... So it's it's been really fun to see like how things kind of change.
Oh my god, it caused a blight too. That's funny. with the corpses so this guy really can't do much ever remove a crit token i swear i had a crit token there i don't, I don't know what just happened a small foundation of trust basically wonder up a bit yeah i i actually somebody made a suggestion to that i thought i actually really liked um and was to change wanderer to not call it wonder like after they do the balance rework and the path rework to not call it wonder but to just call it the class name, right? So that the four paths would be their class name and then their subclasses. So it'd be like, you know, Vestal, Seraph, Chaplain, Confessor. Like, and so like that way, I think I think the problem of Wonder is even just the name of it, like psycholo like psychologically speaking, just sounds like weaker than the alternatives. Because um, it's like, oh, this is like purposely taking a weaker path. If they rework it so it's like, no, this is just the base version the of that like that this is not the basic version of them Let it's just it the die. like the original version of them and then they have subclasses i think that would um yeah it reads as like vanilla it reads as like weak whereas it should just read like this is the hero i made a video about paths way back when they were introduced and basically the video said like um i'm gonna take it i'm not gonna use it it said like don't use paths like i like or like the way paths the should be is that like the wonder path shouldn't be a weaker version of them it should be like a like a good version of them and others should feel like they come with pros and they come with cons and right now you know to play like a specific place so you can get like some intricate interesting play styles um and then uh oh it's wounding words no and then you can do things like you know, have the basic, like, have the original version of them feel very good with their own unique things, and then have these subclasses that have, like, you know, some more intricate, like, you know, play to them to make them feel unique, but also give the base class its own identity. And they've done really well with Sahar. And I think even Reynold, I think Reynold has, like, he feels like he is slightly different on his, his basic, you know, wanderer path with the extra damage and stuff. I think maybe they should swap that with Aggressor, but that's just me. Um, but like, he feels like, you know, he's got identity there. Um, into madness is easier than holding and out the Duelist definitely it. does. And even even they Flag, I think, feels heroes. like he has identity. And, the, and Vestal also has some identity there with like the way that she generates Consecration and stuff. Um, but like taking the wanderer path shouldn't feel like a putt. Like I honestly just don't want to have to take a path every time. I'd like to be able to take the wanderer path and feel like I'm still, I feel like I'm, when I do it, like I get people who come in, they'll be like, oh, you're playing a wanderer highwayman. Like, why the heck are you doing that? And I'm like, well, cause it's like, it's good for him doing ranged and melee damage. You know, I want to do both and like people like, but I think there's a, there's a mentality behind it that it's just bad because like it's, you know, I don't know. Cause it, cause it is when it shouldn't be. So I just hope that that's something they take into account when they're kind of working on restructuring a lot of things and doing path reworks, which they've talked about doing. And it's not going to happen anytime soon. I and mean, the game feels fine right now. I just know that it can feel better. Grave robbers wonder are fairly in their own direction. The paths at least change. Yeah, they do. And it's, like, I think there are some great examples of paths from old systems that feel really good. I think Night Sworn and Venom Drop both feel very good. I think Dead Eye feels really bad. I think Yellow Hand feels really good as a path. I think it's actually a pretty cool way to play. Um, you know, I enjoy that he has like a melee path that has some unique interactions. What's interesting about Yellow Hand versus Sharp Shot is like Sharp Shot, for some reason, feels like it's scaled way too hard for the damage. Whereas Yellow Hand, even though it gets, I don't, does Yellow Hand get any additional damage? Now I think about it, I actually don't know. Uh, it doesn't, right? But it still feels really good. I don't know why that's clipped. That shouldn't be clipped like that. Um, like, Night Sword and Venom Drop feel really good. Poet feels really good. Monarch is interesting. I think it needs some working around. But, like, Tempest feels kind of boring. 
um, sharp shot feels really boring because it's a, like this is this is a good example of like making a melee path about making it just do more damage. It's like it steals more tokens. It gives double cross the ability to actually remove the block and not just hit through the block. So you can actually just apply vulnerable through block. It's really good in a lot of cases, and it gives the bleed resist removal, which is really good. Um, and yeah, and it comes at the cost of your your range damage, but it doesn't just beef up your your melee damage, so you don't feel like you're just doing godly amounts of damage and it just skews things weirdly, like Sharpshot does. Sharpshot just feels bad. Even Rogue feels kind of good, because even though it does give you the additional damage in rank 1, the point of it is that you're only doing that like every other turn. Now, if you get lucky and you get like the, the General's Trophy, or maybe you use um, Crusader's Banneret, Rally and Cry, and lock them into place to get double point blank shot, those are situations where... Yeah, it's going to do a lot of damage, but I still think you're only limited to doing that huge damage to rank one for one turn. So that, I feel like that's fine. Yeah, Tempest does big numbers. I think Tempest needs to change. Like, I'm fine with there being big number things, but they need to have a bigger, like, playoff. Like, if Tempest was, like, increases your damage by that amount, but it, it guarantees the blind on him or something like that, where you actually have to work around the blind... Like, you can't, like, get those times where the blind doesn't proc or something. Like, you get the blind. Like, to me, that'd be, like, an interesting, like, okay, now it's not just an element that I sometimes have to deal with. It's, like, I have to deal with it, and I'm going to have to d generate that combo or just risk the blinds, like, you know, going crazy or something like that. Um, or, I don't know, like, kind of taking uh, an example of the... Um, Tempest being like it guarantees the blind, but you only get the damage buff when he is blind. Kind of like Cruel Intent. Like if they took Cruel Intent and they just made it as Tempest, where it's like it guarantees blind, guarantees one blind or possibly two blind, and then it gives you the damage buff as long as you're blind. So you have to play into that. Um, like that could be interesting, you know? I think that could be a fun path for him. This idea that he's just swinging crazy and, like, he's not really paying... He can't really see what he's doing. It gives the path identity. Like, that could be interesting. I don't know if that's balanced or anything, but, like, that's an interesting idea. Um, like, on Hellion, for example, right? Her carcass path? Her carcass path is one of my favorite paths in the game because it feels like a true subclass. Like, it, it feel I'm actually playing around, like, her winded tokens, which I think are a really boring element outside of carcass. Um, and, like, I'm playing her differently. Like, I have to dramatically change the way I play her in order to, to accommodate for this, and it feels really good when you play her right. So I just think that there's a lot of, like, there's a lot of potential there for, like, fun ways to play that. Okay. I guess I'm leaning into doing the damage here. With hits like that, we should be able to make it happen. Okay. Trammeled, trapped, held captive by fear. Solutions. Even, Even the, big the big ones. Compassion. Rogue feels like a PBS sharp shot version. Uh, I think it's I think it's a little more balanced, just in the sense that like it it you can't just stay in the front rank and spam it over and over and over again without like going through the process of finding a way to lock him into place. And if you go through that pro like I'm fine with there being times where you have like you know, kind of crazy runs that kind of get away from, like, that power creep. As long as they're rare, and they're not, like, super common. I'm just realizing now that you probably can't hear me, Goss. <laughs> Oh, 
the enemy fish and fish and fish and wins. Way more fun to play. It's just the sharp shot is too strong. Oh, sharp shot is, is way too strong. Right? There's just no getting around it. It's too it's too beefy. Um and it just doesn't it it doesn't feel fun. I was, I, was, I made that tier list today and somebody was saying like um you know, you shouldn't be asking for nerfs. Like, you should only be asking for buffs because it feels bad when they nerf a hero because it's like a punishment to the player. And I'm like, I don't think that's true because I think, obviously, there are bad times to nerf heroes. There are bad cases of it. But I think generally, oh, hello. And blaze the trail to I think your generally, um, nerfs need to happen for a lot of cases because, whispers. like, it can, you know, power creep is a thing and it just causes the it causes other heroes to feel bad and other things to feel bad because they're just so lackluster compared to you know highwayman sharpshot or whatever like i almost avoid playing sharpshot at this point just because it's boring like i only play it when i absolutely have to like the last time i did it was when i when i didn't realize i was on act two and i had to swap to sharpshot just to make the damage up for a you know, the fact that I had no backline damage. Rest tonight. And that was like the only time I did Under and I felt bad about doing it. <laughs> gaze. Yeah, the nerf to man arms, yeah. And he's, like I said in my hero tier list, he's still S-class, he's still incredible. Like that's how freaking buff he was. As even with all those nerfs, he still feels really, really good. <laughs> Eight mastery points Rain, right now. Fire, cool. Is there no sanctuary I think it's time for some sluice madness. juice, don't y'all? Paracelsus and Gonzalez. I need to get something else to drink. I drank this yesterday. Didn't drink two in one sitting. <laughs> Though I could. <laughs> I got some water. All right. There's a good chance for me to go uh, walk around a little bit, uh, stretch my legs, and get some water. It's a good chance for all of you to get some water and stretch your legs and you know, do things you need to do. So take this as a self-care break. I will be right back. Enjoy some clips in the meantime. And uh, hey, if you're not following, you should follow me. You should do that. Okay, one sec. Which I guess is kind of a common out outcome of getting shanked, but like, we really, we really gave it to him, you know? Look, I'm a violent pickle, all right? When you picked me up, I wasn't dill or spicy or sweet. I was violent. Violence in a jar, motherfucker. But I'm a banana and you can fuck it. Don't wait, no. Okay, okay. I, okay. Phrasing, I don't mean you can fuck the banana. Please do not fuck your produce, okay? That's unhealthy, unsanitary, and overall disgusting. All right. Where was I keeping that? Where, where, where was that stored? You know what, don't answer that question. I don't <clears throat> don't want to know actually. Um, where, yo, come on, girl. Let's go, both of you. Let's go. You want some of this? You want a little bit of boop? Yeah, you do. You want a little bit of boop? We all just chilling now. We all just hanging out. Oh, ah, uh, boop. Yeah, that's what I fucking thought. You want some? You, you want some? Ooh, spiky. Mm, I like it. Could you guys attack me, please? Thank you. Jesus Christ, kill me. End my life. You guys, you guys are bitches. Yeah, you a bitch. Is that it? Is that all you got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Who's gonna chompy chomp next? Who's next? This guy. He's doing the chompy chomp. Chomp, 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 chomp. Boop. All right, we're almost there, boys. We're almost there. That's it. Ah! There we go. All right, fuck you. Oh, hey guys. How we? How we doing? We doing good? Yeah. Yeah, I also like getting gangbanged by snake men. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Okay, I'm really concerned about this. Ah, fuck! Jesus Christ. Let's face it, God is daddy. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> This is fun and fair. This is a fun and fair game. That's fun and fair. Ah, stop it. It hurts. <laughs> what is the cooldown on that? Oh. Nobody figure it out. 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 Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? God damn it.
Another. Thank you. Yep. Oh god, there should be a cooldown on that. There is apparently not. God damn it. Reagan! No! Where is it? No! Why is it not on a cooldown? Oh my god. You guys fucking suck. Ah, oh, this fucking skip is so fucking annoying. Fuck you, Knight. What you gonna do about it? Where are you gonna go? You can't get to me. Fuck you. Mom's underwear. Great, delicious, lovely. Why the fuck did I say delicious? Wood ooh. Give me that wood, daddy. Huh? I tried to do something stupid. Alright. Don't blame me, alright. I like it when it plays the Dark Souls one, because it's like it just Wait yeah. A the guy who dies a lot, that's who! A chat that blasts ass together is a chat that stays together. Those are words I'll live by. Oh, that's a lot of that. That's a lot of ass. Oh, I didn't put trinkets on! Oh, no! Did I put an accuracy trinket on her? No, I didn't. God. Damn it. Back in my day, I didn't have this hover shit for this TikTok shit. All I had was Vine. Six second long videos. My Tumblr definitely agrees God is daddy. Oh my God. We don't need to talk about my Christian Tumblr, Tumblr days, all right? Is the greatest teacher of all. Not memories I need to relive. Yo, what's up, Starfuck? How you doing? Yo, oi, oi, you sexy fuck. Oi, oi. How's it going? Welcome on in. Welcome hello. to hello. the commission shenanigans. Oh, sorry. Thank you for the follow. Hello. Appreciate hello. It. hello. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, how's it going? We're having a goofy ass fucking run right now. Oh, man. Yeah, my, my equilibrium is really fucked up. Ooh, I think I've got a clogged ear or something. Causing me all sorts of goofiness. Billy Butcher from The Boys. I don't know what that is. I don't know. These, these your references scare me because I don't understand them. Sure, what's the great stunning blow? We're getting a lot of value out of stunning blow right now. Also getting a lot of value out of tracking shot. Like we're getting some crazy value out of these things going on right now. Watch the boys. I have not. No, I'm sorry. I know I'm probably a terrible human being for that. I apologize profusely. I can't believe we got so many mastery points out of that. It's because you're an old man like me. I am old, very old. Planning and mindfulness as vital to survival. Are we going to the tangle? No, we're going steel. to the sluice. We could go to the tangle though and use this almanac, the Talmanac, um, from Diablo One. I never played Diablo One. Hey, Talus, how's it going? How you doing, man? How are things going? Bolt it on and be off. Yeah, I'm gonna put it on for now. I think I think we can denied. have some fun in the sluice. Let's go have let's go have a jolly good old time in the sluice. A grand old time. What stagecoach item do we have? I actually don't remember. We uh, do we have any food items? Conventional food. Fare. Any food but items? It's going. Good to hear. I mean, going is is better than not going. I'll definitely take that. Uh, all right, we don't really need to work on relationships because we've got the roaring the roaring hearth right now, but we should probably just buy some stuff because, like, you know, stuff to buy is good stuff. Have we eaten anything? We have not. Did we not generate any stew that section? That's kind of annoying. Uh, I guess I'll just take bread here. Yeah. 
Interesting. I fought something. I fought a butcher in Diablo 4. I don't know if that's like the same butcher, you know, but. Um, yeah, I mean, Siemens boot value is good, but not incredible. Like this is guaranteed, right? Now, misstep. Misstep's a pretty good one for the additional healing. We do, or health, we do lose a lot of damage, but like, that's still, that's a lot of health. It's a, it's a lot of health. I think we're going to go with this. It's the same kind of monster. Ah, okay. All right, there we go. Now, greater cleansing sensor on anybody. Uh, honestly, probably better there, right? Like, yeah, it's going to not be as potent of a... Well, it's actually... I think, yeah, I think it's the same debuff resist, so I'm fine with that. We can drop this one, actually. And... Um... 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 um should probably buy some items just thinking like a bit of for the future here on the we got good items we should buy them in diablo 4 does it feel scary or because you expect it right and i have a feeling it might happen how are we doing on stress we're at zero stress god i would love to find a hospital we're not going to find a hospital but we might find a kyrogen's table either way i think we're surviving just fine let's go all right I think Crusader's stance here is really wide. You can't really see it, but um, I don't know. I feel like this is. I feel like he's really just like puffed out in this in this uh, stance. I don't know why. Tried and tested. Tried and tested. Uh, we're only using judgment here, so that's cool. According to Blizzard's Diablo lore, the butcher isn't a demon. Is it? It's a type of demon isn't a demon but it's a type of demon he didn't make an appearance in diablo 2 but he was one of the bosses in act Dread 1 in diablo 3 and he was in diablo 4 quickly. interesting how this how is he is not a demon but is a type of demon i'm confused by this oh, i don't understand that a stranger to itself <sighs> they revel in debauchery Debasing themselves in the face of the end. Oh, is it more just like in the first one, he wasn't an individual, but like a classification kind of thing? I don't know. Uh, we'll take the fight here. Demon space. Oh, okay, okay. Is there a reason your game tends to crash? I I don't think so. Oh god, there's a full gore here. Um. I, I couldn't tell you. you. There's lots of reasons it could be crashing. I don't know off the top of my head why yours would be. God damn. Thank God for misstep, because that would have fucking hurt otherwise. Oh boy. All right. I didn't need to put that on him, actually. Oh, well. We, we focus damage into this guy. Okay, so he went from being like his own distinct thing to being a more... Okay, that makes sense. More than many of the bosses in the game. Yeah, you can't let Fulgar live for very long because otherwise he just, he just makes problems for you. Boom! Fucking god damn, that feels good. Had death armor too. I'm I'm surprised he doesn't have at least one death armor or a way to give himself death armor. I mean, I'm kind of happy he doesn't, but like I'm just surprised, you know. Hmm. Did you like living? I hope you didn't. <laughs> oh yeah, Crusader feeling pretty good with this whole setup going Steady on right yourself. now. Yourself. 
Come closer, my children. Would make Stygian runs way more scary. It would. I, I don't know. I feel like all the elite enemy variants should at least have a way of getting death armor. Like some of the some enemies have, like start with none, but if they use an ability, they get some death armor. I feel like that would be fine for them. Like yeah, they're supposed to be scary, you know. Like they're they're meant to be. They're meant to be. Oh god! Ah, I can't tracking shot you. Well done. Yeah, well, you're dead now, so that's cool. Go for the highwayman. Ah. Uh, Shame. I gotta remove this corpse. Probably always avoid the sluice valid. Actually, valid. A righteous action. Yeah, strength plus crit plus vulnerable. Oh, this is a good trinket to get, though. Honestly, actually, I think this is great because he is inadvertently guarding and just taking a lot of damage in general. We might as well apply combo where we can, in my very humble opinion. I kind of like the speed on her. We're going to I'm going to keep this for now, but we're probably going to end up dropping it. But army armored the zombie minion does. I mean, I base. get the foot soldiers having the death armor. This supposed to be like super resilient, but I think the trade-off there that doesn't make any sense is that they also do really good damage. Like, they should do, like, pretty low damage if they're going to be that, like, tough to kill. But... Zombie minion? Oh, I thought you were talking about the foot soldiers. Oh, you're, ta you're talking about the, uh... Um, the woodsman. Oh, no, you are talking about the foot soldiers. Okay. The tangle minions. Yeah. Hey, Nave, how's it going? Cool. This is just a disease run. What do you got now? Okay. That's cool. Can we please, like, find a hospital? That'd be mega cool. That'd be, like, mega, mega dope cool awesome. I'm just saying, like... Steady yourself. Those are the drummer. Yeah, the drummer gives for the protection and stuff. Yeah, no, I, I feel you. I should have put illumination on, honestly, for this area. Like illumination goes fucking hard here. A steady subtraction. Cool. An Double crit token. Result. Hmm. Yeah. That's be a lot of. Glad I took off uh, Battlefield Medicine. Why did I take off Battlefield Medicine? I don't recall. Probably to play into some, like a mag rain thing for burn or some shit. I don't know. Thankfully, I haven't seen Brittle Bones in quite a long time. Funny how little damage he does when you're not like lined up to do damage with him. Can't avoid me now. Messy. God, my ear. Holy crap. Have I seen leper two? What? <laughs> leper squared? Oh, you mean like if he gets leprosy? All right. I need to. 
think about some abilities here. Um, I don't need Magrain. I need Battlefield Medicine. I don't need... Uh, I have all these upgraded. I'll keep them. That's fine. Oh, one of my last Tempests. Yeah, Leper of Leprosy. Yeah. It's funny when it happens. It's annoying, but it's funny. Creature dead. Not really the thing I'm looking for right now. We gotta take it, too, so... Puppies! Everybody look at the puppies. They... Three of them dodged it. Okay. Gonna need that regen, I think. Incremental. But deadly all the same. That the blight hit when it doesn't work on hit while it doesn't work on other yeah. Ugh, come on. How wait. Oh, there's the one that can't get stealth. Any being, however horrid, can be brought to heal. That's stress reduction too, which is nice. What's giving her days here? Disease, cholera, is that cholera giving her days? That's guaranteed. I forgot about that. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. A miscalculation, perhaps. His repost is uh, not working super well, mostly because we're just guard. Everything's being guarded. Well, like, I guess that could be worse. Fucking cholera, dude. All that speed that we put on her is completely useless at this point. We might as well swap out um, the speed token, the speed thing on her, and just swap it for something else. A little help impeccably timed. A whole bunch of other yummy goodness there. We could probably IS that. Or we can do that. There we go. That works. The fiend's strength dwindles. Good resists. Guaranteed crit because of the combo token, so that's fine. Like nothing we can do about that. the stun there. Moving him forward so that way the guard doesn't proc on him as often is actually causing problems for us at this point.
Yeah, all that free days. Lovely. Go ahead and heal her. There goes the guard. Now it's on the Vestal. Oh. Okay. Forgot about Coward there. Enemy weakens and wanes. Heal. That's all I could do from up here. There we go. The one pleasant in the extreme. Uh, I would have really liked no the one more. that removes diseases. That would have gotten necessary. so much value out of that. Unfortunately, we got spiders in the last one. There. I'm actually going to go ahead and do this, because right now, this extra speed is doing nothing for us. Like, actually bona fide doing nothing. It's just sitting there looking dumb. Um, it's normally something I would enjoy, but we're not going to be able to enjoy it, so it's fine. The swine were first reported by denizens of a small hamlet nestled on the eastern coast. Okay, this is going to be dangerous, but also necessary for us. Um, for sure. Lots of healing here. All right. Time to get rid of those diseases. Yeah, Kyrogen's going to be busy today. But we do have to be cautious here because this fight can get away from us very quickly if we're not very careful here. So, probably will not be able to do. Oh, fucking hell. Of course, that landed like four stress. Like... Really? Only nine damage? Yikes. Okay. And we're just critting now. Okay. Well, he had a crit token, I guess, so I shouldn't be so surprised. Uh, I really should have thrown Illumination on it. I did not. I didn't really think about that. Uh, yeah, we... Well, I can track and shot, actually. That's going to be the best option here, is stop that crit from landing. Yeah, the patients are very scary, absolutely. I agree. I hate that that's like, oh no, you, you don't like that. I hate that. Don't move me, it stresses me out. Shut up. Hmm. Stunned. Bro, what is up with these crits right now? Days and now he gets his crit off. <sighs> Sometimes this game, man. I, I, that's gonna, there he goes. All right. Well, there we go. Thank you, video aim. Okay, well, I guess I can't complain too much, but that's still... The fact that we were able to get that happening is just ridiculous, <laughs> but whatever. Oh my god. Now I can't point blank because of this.
Why, why are you, he's saying he's mad. Why is he mad? He's a zero stress. What the fuck, dude? This game. Mm. I think he's gonna get another attack off. Super fun. The fact that he was able to land two of his attacks during this fight at all is just not good. Not good on my end. Okay. I love how that ghoul just like appears. He's just like, I'm I'm here now. Like, oh, okay. Just do damage. The stun is just unlikely. Free heal. Cool. Thanks. He doesn't get the debuffs there. <laughs> uh, we need the diseases removed, so please go ahead. Take smallpox from me. Thank you. good. I think Reynolds gonna fucking melt down and stop. Oh my fucking god, dude. What is it then that takes us back so intently from the abyss? Bro, I... Can you pick the other guy, please, to remove the disease from? Not the same one every time? Thank you. Why did that stress you out? What? The fiend's strength dwindles. I don't think I've ever seen them get stressed from somebody using a combat item on them. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. Oh, nope, not getting begins. stunned today. What's his stun resist? I'm assuming it's very high, if not like... Yeah, 75% chance. Probably should have seen that happening. Stupendous. Yeah, Galia will make Dismas keep his disease. Good call. Is that what it's called? Galia? Yeah, Galia. Alright. This is the play then. We need that guard to go away. Accumulation. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Sweat soaked brows. I mean, I think he evens out for the most part. Takes hold. 
touches Skyrogen butts. Yes. There we go. All right. So at least we have now removed all of our diseases. Two damage. Oh my god, dude. I'm about to lose it. Fucking hell. Fragile? Why did he also do two damage there? How did that happen? Bro, this game is just out for me today. What the fuck is going on? What lurks in the beyond? From blood. Oh yeah, bloodletting. Yeah, I forgot about that. A breakthrough. Still, this is just dumb, dude. Cut. Continues. What are we gonna get from that? Fucking probably the spike the skull cap. Is gone. Oh, we get Let apron. We get leeches. Fine. Is apron good on anybody? Not really. I don't even think we want apron. I'm mean, gonna take it, but I don't think we want it. The loathing whispers. Reynold is struggling, dude. He's on the struggle bus right now. He's on the bus. And the wheels are not going around. Well, I guess I can give Junior her speed back. That's gonna be important for her to have speed. A simple choice. At least it should right. be. Sorry, Ray. That was. I like how Ray has less health than my fucking plague doctor right now. Nice. At least it's not sh at least it's not shattered will. Absolutely fucking true. Go away, I wanna fight this one. Take an absolute fucking beating. My regards. Brittle bones would be really nightmarish. It would be absolutely fucked up. <laughs> That's what it would be. This wound at least has been tended to. Getting you healed up, don't worry. Persistence will overcome even the greatest of threats. Is Shadow Will mutually exclusive with soft and fragile? I don't think they're I don't think so. I don't I don't know if they can stack. It'd be fucking funny if they could. I've not seen them stack, so I'm assuming that probably not. Okay, Perhaps give me something I good video game. Make up for all this craziness we just dealt Perhaps with. You left it for yourself. <laughs> I mean, Perhaps I it is not here at all. Don't care about any of these. Maybe operating table. Eh. 
I, I can count on one hand how many times I've seen operating table proc. And we don't really need it right now. We've got leeches, so... You know? Well, that was definitely a sluice. What the fuck was that? Did you see that, like, rock there? That was weird. It was, like, a, just not normally something you see. I just love the idea of this inn inside this, like, mountain cave entrance. There are yet places such as this, <laughs> where a little light still gathers. <laughs> uh, why? Spend what you can, or wealth no longer has meaning. Dude, if what is up with these works right now? <laughs> Rain, fire, and rot. Is there no sanctuary from this madness? One learns quickly. Evil smile. Yeah. Demands it. it feels like it right now. But the mastery has been pretty good, so we're almost maxed out on mastery. I think we might be. Five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we're maxed out. I mean, that's good. Junior and Ray, you guys are going to drink together. You better be friendly about it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Paracelsus and... Highlandman. Always gone too fast, indeed. Yeah, very unlikely that anybody's going to form a negative relationship. I think we have one chance at 5%. So that's good. Drop the candle. Each improvement. Uh, we are going to the tangle, right? So we actually get some value out of the, the Talmanac. I guess I'll... Uh, I don't know. I mean, it increases stacking of them, but we don't really have many. But it increases the quantity of items produced. Ah, it's worth it. Experimentation. Your academic instincts serve you well. Okay, we've already eaten. Um, but one stress total. So I'm not super worried about that. So now I start thinking about things I want to take for getting towards the final fight. A bit of Just to stack ourselves up here as much as we can. We're going to go ahead and drop these items. And somebody's going to yell at me about that, I'm sure. That's fine. You guys are more than welcome to yell at me about it. How are we doing on health? Nobody's low on health, so I'm not going to use a stitching kit here. Um, so good with that. Well, yeah, they both they both work really well together. So it's if we can grab them, we should. And we did. The stack of laudanum. Uh, we do have a stack of holy water here. Do we have another holy water we can take? No. Some Greek fire, I'm sure. Neutralizing powders can be good for the fight. You know what I am worried about? I'm worried about this. This on phase two of the coward fight. Of the, the body of work fight. That's going to be... It's basically like take aim without take aim, so. Aspiration unites the hopeful. I'm a little concerned about that. This should be fine, but, you know, copying a bunch of tokens, especially crit tokens and whatnot, is going to be problematic. I'm wondering if the guard will help, though. Like, if he's guarding the person with all the tokens, will he still Four. hit? Will he ignore the guard or not? Only. So, we're not going to a Kyrogen's table. I'm not doing that bullshit again. Nope. Sorry, Nox. Not now. Uh, we should go to the right here. 
Let's see what we get this way. There's a Shambler's Altar. Oh, goody. Yeah, everybody else has been like, nope. Does it ignore guard? I, I don't know. That's what I'm asking. I don't think I've tried using that to ignore it, but I'm assuming that it would be ignored. What purpose have we for all this abundance? The longer we're at this, the less the loot matters. Yeah. More items for uh, prepping for the final region. Um, we're gonna get another cultist fight out this. Go for the. I'm not going to the Shambler's Altar. We we've already done another enough mini bosses today. We've done a Warlord and a Kyrogen. I don't. The loathing howls. General, I'm not fighting the general. <laughs> this team would not do well against the general. If we had Banneret, though, bet Banneret would work super well, but we don't have it. Axis also ignores guard. I don't know. I don't know enough about Strange Axis to really say yay or nay on that. I'm entirely honest. It took me forever to even realize that Strange Axis changed taunt into stealth. Because I don't, it, it flips tokens. I don't know what it would flip. You know. It does ignore dodge, yes. I know it ignores dodge. Like, it's built to ignore defensive tokens, right? The whole point is the to Avatar flip everything around. Oblivion. So I don't, I don't know. Clergy of the spreading stain. Oh. Okay. Cool. That's fine. Just don't resolute. Whoops. Loathing is a fun fun mechanic, guys. I love how loathing doesn't go down at ends. Super fun. I know I'm just bitching at this point, but it's it's funny to bitch. I guess a stun may have been more proactive, but we can probably save the stun for whoever decides to do Nocturne Commune. The Loathing House. <laughs> I like how they're getting blights through. It's funny. First trumpet landing blights is fucking weird. I mean, I know why it's doing it. It's just weird. I should have seen that coming, honestly. Excellent work. It's a ranged version of inversion used by these bagpipe boys, pretty much. I mean, these are ranged. It is a ranged ability. Oh, I should have used it here. It gets rid of crit tokens. I didn't even see the crit token, honestly. Whoopsie daisy. Yeah, I, I it does tend to like crop up the least, I would say. But let's see if I can push this guy back. Oh. We do get a daze. I mean, that could be useful for us. Means we can probably get the stun here, honestly. We at least remove the combo or the crit tokens. So even if they resist it, they get rid of the crit token. Double dodge. Love that. That was a big brain moment right there. Love that for us. Nice. 
This wound at least has been getting the crit from Galia on the heel. That's pretty. That's pretty. That's pretty big brain right there. Nice. The past is gone. Let it die. Stirring snuff is pretty good. Um, I don't know if it's as good as this though. The combo lines us up for some, yeah. It lines us up for some natural stuns and stuff, which is really good. The loathing I do need to think about the final I guess we have Disorienting Blast, so like it's not that big of a deal. Yeah, we should be fine. The Disorienting Blast on the on the roster, we should we should be okay in the final fight. As long as we can move stuff forward that needs to come forward. Everybody who can hit who who can hit range can hit range and front. These two guys are the, gonna be the struggle, but at least we can move them. So I'm not super worried about that. God, I really don't want to do another creature den. That's like the fourth one. All right. <laughs> I also don't want to max my loathing out again. But we've already gotten two loathing somehow from this. I guess I could go for the hospital. How have I gotten another load? I just did a cult. Oh, my God. Are you serious? Yeah, cultist node took it down, but then just instantly went back up. Loathing is such a dumb fucking mechanic. We need to a hospital would be great. All right. I don't have any money left, though, but... We could at least get rid of something. I don't know. God, uh, cowardice would probably be fine. We've gotten rid of the diseases, so I guess we're not running around as much. In fact, we should probably get rid of Holy Lance then uh, for the final fight. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. The lost no, not the dying world, empty of hope and humanity. <laughs> Damn, he resisted it. Damn. Poor Ray. Goodbye, stress. Goodbye, tracking shop. Or help. You can take the stealth off this guy. He just... He just sits back there and, like... Keeps playing his little music box. Ow. Speed running every disease in the game today, guys. Just so you know. At least you're going to Oswald. I have an in item to also take care of it. A simple variable, easily. What is going on? Seems to be allergic to high HP. Yeah, he really doesn't want the HP, nor does he want to heal at all anymore. So he gets no more road heals, which is great. Man, I was saving that money to spend on somebody getting rid of a fucking quirk, but you know what? I guess we're just going to have to deal with um, getting rid of a disease. I mean, it's good timing. It's the best timing I could probably ask for it, so. For the fallen and knows How do we pick up, do we pick up two items enough. here? Like, what's going on? Why am I...
I mean, I can stack multiple healing items, so I might as well start building them up, right? When you're running no healer comps, I mean, yeah, it's it's like the anti-healer. Guys, you guys all want me dead. Everybody on this team wants me to die. No, not doing a shambler's altar, okay? It's not happening, video game. Slippery. Mm. Okay. At least you're not getting a repair fight. Not that I know of. Nah, we shouldn't. We shouldn't at this point. I mean, exemplar is going to be interesting. Oh my god, I do not need this much. I don't, actually, I don't even need any of this as far as food goes. What do I want on the mountain? Uh, I'll take the speed. It's fine. You know, I think Ray's here. I think Ray's, Ray's right here. I don't think we take additional fights right now. I think we, we take as few fights as we can at this point. We got we got shit to do everybody. Oh my god, what the fuck am I picking up all this garbage? I mean, sure, we'll put on I'll put on these and then we'll go to a fight. We'll go to the we'll go to the hoarder, we'll go to the fight. Well, actually, I don't even know if I need that anymore. We're, we're going to get 45 torchlight from this assistance encounter, so you have rabbit? Yeah, but I don't care about the plus one HP from stuff. If I had food barrels or ice box or something, I'd be able to actually do a build for it, but I only have other stuff. I'll take the 45 torchlight, yeah. Okay. Now I don't need to worry about taking the fight, so we just go straight. All right. Oh, God, no, damn it. Oh. That was, that was a misplay. The misplay. <laughs> Pity a soul so twisted by despair. Well, I think the boss has what fifty percent additional health now. <laughs> Hey, buddy! How you doing? Nox, no, buddy. I'm sorry. Put down. Um... Could this guy just not... That'd be great. We can rely only upon each other. Yeah, I can't wants to play, but I'm I do not want to right now. Oh, I hit a crit token. I guess I can't. 
complain about him having crit tokens. Why has everybody got crit tokens? This fucking act. God damn. Good fucking hit. Alright. Plus 80% damage. Good job, Ray. Keep it up. How's the run going, buddy? It's been an unhinged run. Not, it's been it's been silly. Okay, well, we need to fucking kill him now before he manages to bring that dude back to life. When I kill him. Thankfully, he's going before him, so that's good. Trammeled, trapped, held captive by fear. He's already used one of his benediction tokens, so that's really good. Inspire and cry, get the stress down. All right. Steady yourself. Fucking hell. It's a yeah. I think we've had like six diseases, six, seven diseases at this point. And we only got one from the Kyrogen's table. The rest of them were just natural diseases that we cured over time. So this has been a run. The fiend's strength dwindles. Bro, why is he getting so many crit tokens? I know he's ordained, but Jesus. What is the spawn rate on that? 10% chance. I think he's gotten one every fucking round. A lesson taught is a lesson learned. I mean, that fight could have gone a lot worse <laughs> with a fallen Templar. An inkling of potency still lingers in some of these well-worn relics. Yeah, I've been having a time. I don't know if I call it a great time. This has been a run. That's why stolen wine just always tastes better. Yeah. All right, so. We do have an exemplar fight coming up. Let's see what we can do here. We should have some decent counters for it. We do not need the torch light. Yeah, that. Uh, we can stack these higher. There we go. All right. Tabu, I was a tap worried at the start. Yeah, thankfully that bark man no longer works, so. One of list added to the list of things that are too broken for me to want to fix anymore. Loathing made manifest. Loathing made manifest. Just BB sounds. Yeah, make the best sounds. Ghastly Grill proccing there, very nice. Probably should have seen that coming. Even with the crit, yeah. Oh well. This road cannot be walked alone. 
Uh, it's not. It's weird that it prioritizes flesh weaving only sometimes. It feels like. Now it's just gonna get. Well, actually, it can't. Thankfully. God damn, dude. This is where Reap comes in really beneficial. That reduced healing on this is definitely like something you like want to lean into if you can. It's gonna be able to do the fall. God damn it. What is it then? Double turns, man. It's where outspeeding the enemy actually comes in a negative on these fights. A master stroke. In crisis, we can rely only upon each other. Yeah, exaltation hits like a fucking monster. A breakthrough. The fiend's strength dwindles. So it ended here. Most, well, we are. Hello, Arden. Oh man, I was kind of scared it was gonna heal it there. Greatest of threats. No, I mean, no. If if uh, Plague Doctor was going, we might be able to stun it by using Tropium, but. Alas, we cannot, so let's take a swing at the corpse and call it a day. Anxiety forms insidious fears. All right. Could be worse. An inkling of potency still lingers in some of these well-worn yeah. relics. Everybody's super mad at each other right now, but they're not that upset. It's just they just feel like they're that upset. They think they're mad at each other. Stop. I don't care. Drop drop everything. I don't give a shit. Huh? I changed what? Game giveaway? What do you mean I changed game giveaway? I'm so confused. The fire is lit. The table is set. Lazy eye, great. Awaits its Used to be 10k. Guests. I did not change it. Is it changed? Is it different? I haven't messed with it. Oh. Hmm. That shouldn't be the case. I don't know. I'll, I'll fix it later. All right. Cool, Melphobic, that's great. Do we have anybody with disease? Nope, nobody with disease. We're doing a game giveaway on Sunday, so I will save the game giveaway for now. I, mean, I guess everybody can get disease with this. I don't think it really makes a difference. I love how I had all these candles and... Yeah. I 
Paracelsus and Gonzalez. I can't use that. Spend what you can. Pig. For wealth no longer has meaning. Everybody likes pig. If indeed it ever did. All right. Everybody is fairly happy. Nobody is super mad, which is good. I'm happy with that. All right, Master Trainer. Um, are there any the abilities I don't want all. to use after this? When I get to like a fight or something. I can probably switch off Holy Lance. Find that people question your British stashes given your uh, accent. They do. They tend to do it quite often. Um, Chief nepotism officer. But uh, I do have a thing about it in my bio down below. And yeah, you're more than welcome to ask about it. It's a requirement here. Yeah, people, people do ask about it. Pretends. Yes, I do. I pretend. I absolutely pretend that I'm British. I was not a British citizen for 19 years of my life. Um, I'm trying to think what I want to do here. Do I want to go into Reap or Tenacity? Tenacity is pretty good. Um, starting off the fight with Tenacity to, like, give us the additional healing received and also just give us the debuff resist is pretty nice. Block tokens are also good. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to go with Tenacity. I'm going to try that out. I'm going to see how that feels. And other than that... I don't think we're going to swap much in or out. So I'll just upgrade something and call it call it a day. Um, Planning and mindfulness as vital. To right, survival let's see what do we got money wise steam. here. We do have enough for a skull tea if we really want it. Uh. Yeah, we'll take Skull T and I'll, I'll I'll waste the money and throw it on Junior. Why not? We'll get rid of. I mean, she's still de she's dealing good damage. I don't want to lose that damage on her. All Other than that, I think we're good. The mountain, but only one leads beyond it. That going. We've got that. Put some laudanum on. All right. All right. Aspiration unites the hopeful. A lot of hope going around here. All right, so we're going to go ahead and do the thing that Batesa tried to do. We're going to go ahead and give away a game. Uh, it is not Darkest Dungeon. <laughs> That's on Sunday. We are giving away a key for this on Sunday. I'm going to go ahead and open up a giveaway for a random Steam key. Exclamation enter for a chance to join if you'd like a chance to win a random steam key. Um, again, it's not 